Hello, Delaware Valley, and particularly Delco in Delaware County. This is Delco Live, and it's June 20th, 2022. 6202022. Tonight, we have a special guest with a special dream that's going to put Delco on the map and possibly on the covers of, uh, you know, some uh, magazines you can pick up at the local Acme. Whoop, whoop. Uh, we've also <laughs> got uh, some cringeworthy Tinder profile pics and, uh, you know, not related to this. And a couple other stories, and maybe a Delco Day recap if we're you know nice enough with time. Right. Oh, we have sponsors though that give us money. And we have to you know acknowledge them, right? Yeah, yes, we do. Cool. Uh, Tell us let's, more. let's start with Fat Cow Jerky, utterly perfect jerky. All That's the place. A pun. It's, it is a pun. Very good, Holbrook. Very proud of you figuring well, that out. A meeting about, about like not talking over promo. Thirty days in into doing thirty times into this promo. Yes, it is utterly perfect jerky. Great pun. Tell us more. FatCowJerky.com. Uh, find them on Facebook, Instagram. All these delicious flavors and more. Follow them on all their Instagram, Facebook posts, as well here at Delco Live. Uh, our newer sponsor, the Cherry Firm. Check them out, the CherryInjuryLaw.com. Call them 610-565-0300. David Cherry will help you with your workers' compensation, motor vehicle accidents, personal injury, and for you Delco scumbags, criminal law. <laughs> <laughs> I need, him on, I need him on speed dial. Yeah. <laughs> I'll go by his initials so he can look like Dr. Cherry. Dr. Cherry. Dr. Cherry. And uh, Dolan's is having a lot of Palooza because it, there's going to be a lot of Palooza going on behind Dolan's in the R Park Tavern. A lot of cops said to fucking arrest me that day. Yeah, and, and on Sellers Avenue, Dolan's is having it. It's going to be the whole back lot, some good bands, and then Pint for Pint also will be there. Uh, Whiskey and wine, Ziggy and the Moon Dogs. Uh, there's a couple other ones. Uh, we'll the have... one dude, uh, the fucking dude, uh, Walt Lafty. Yes. So, all right. So he's actually a pretty big deal. Do you remember the band Silver Tide from this area? Yes. That was like MMR's fucking like love child for like 2006 through like 2010. They were okay. like, the, like you know how like you know how like our generation had the Soraya that WMMR pushed all the time. Uh, yes. Walt Lafty is from. I think he's a songwriter. He's a singer of Silver Tide. And they had they opened for Van Halen uh, when they came by in like 2007 or whatever. And they had one song that you'd fucking know. It's oh, I know it. Silver Tide, yeah. The one that's like, I'm not coming home. That's him. It's like spot on, it's by the way. That was a like spot it. on. Like, so I, he's playing, and for some reason, they want Pine for Pine to play after. I assume so they can run out of time. We only have to play a couple minutes or we send people home. Yeah, you know, that's for the cleanup crew you're playing. Yeah, yeah. I heard Josh Zaner's got you set up for that one, so you can cut <laughs> <to> your. <laughs> oh. Um, full disclosure, uh, whiskey and wine, they're awesome. They play yeah. the last lot, and uh, I think I promised the Delco Day spot maybe next year. Oh, I think now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're awesome. awesome. I've heard it. Well, sorry, we're cutting oh, pint for pint anyway, so you'll be fine. Okay. All right, just so you know. Um, and for all you new, uh, new listeners out tonight, if you're on Facebook, hit that like. If you're on YouTube, smash that subscribe Sweet. button. Thank you. And we have we have another announcement, a couple now. Yeah, one announcement at least tonight. Uh, and and a special guest, Holbrook. Why don't you take so it? I just noticed that this is not Carrie. It's not Carrie. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah. it's not it's Carrie. Not Carrie. I was like, Carrie, did something with your hair. I'm like, no. <laughs> I want a little darker. Yeah, you definitely want a little darker. Do you microblade too? I did. Okay, cool. Like a little threading too. <laughs> He's obsessed yeah. with microblading. So, who are you? I'm Laura. Hi, Laura. Laura. Thompson. How are you going to use your whole name? Sure. You don't have you don't have a fake like a stage name, a pseudonym. Georgette. Georgette. Yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. I call you LT. What's that? LT? Sure. Okay. okay. Laura with an A. With an A. Laura, where are you from? 
So I grew up in Fallcroft. Of course you did. My whole entire family's from Ridley. Are you old or new Fallcroft? <laughs> like, is that are you? Is that old are you money? Are is that old money? Or are you uh, are you uh, old Fallcroft? So Taylor, are you like Taylor Drive? Or are you like fucking Valley View? Oh, that's fucking that's that's the <laughs> village. That's the village. That wasn't the village. That is that is the village, right? No, is an old Fallcroft near Mister X. Yeah. Yeah, so the village. But I wasn't in the village. Well, I guess you're like the outskirts of the village. I was you're the kind outskirts. of like the on the, the nether region of, of Fallcroft. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> the taint of Fallcroft. So I guess with that, did you go to uh, Academy Park? I sure did. Okay, okay, okay. And you are here. Why? Because my sister made me. Understood. Understood. <laughs> I just figured you had gotten lost leaving the Burgundy. Then I realized attractive women don't go to the Burgundy. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> your sister had went really, really early for a lot of Palooza. She, she went to the Burgundy by accident. Over you, obviously. <laughs> heavy influence by, was it your big sister? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Big sister said you got to. She's you gotta, great. You got to go on Dalco Live. And yeah, you're like, she okay. sure did. She made me. Right she on. was like, be there then. Right. So <laughs> you appear to be some sort of model. I'm not a model, but I'm some trying sort of. to be a okay. model. And you were trying to be a model for what? From Maxim Magazine for Maxim. the 2022 Cover Girl shoot. 2022 Cover Girl shoot. Do they say when? I mean, spoiler alert: it's a competition to anyone out there listening. Did they say when the that um uh, uh month is like what month is it going to be? Like that you would be on when a photo shoot? No, like like you know how it's like no like, uh, when would it come so, out? Yeah. But they say when a photo shoot takes place. Okay, but it will be within the year of 2022. Yeah. Oh, oh so yeah. There's only. Like, and this thing's done, what, in August? August, yes. August 8th. Right? So you have pretty much from August to December before you'll be at one point on maximum cover. Either October or November is the shoot. Okay. okay. Oh, mm-hmm. so we assume no, December then to finish up here. Things are getting uh, real. Uh, oh, there yeah. You go. <laughs> so you have never modeled before. So when I was really young, my mom put us in modeling and I modeled for Sears. So like John and- Ramsey shit? <laughs> Some like little kid stuff, you know. We were Jesus. pretend we were mannequins in the mall yes. and did like runway walks in Granite Run Mall. <laughs> <laughs> Just all the things that make me see more like a serial killer. Believe it or not, <laughs> believe yeah, it or not, I was actually a model at one point. I know, I should, uh, yeah, I don't believe it. <laughs> it, it. It's true, it's true. Yeah, model for poor health <laughs> <laughs> in high school. Uh, when I had a what did you model, Al? <laughs> Uh, I modeled suits for uh, for uh, prom night. Did you really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, for fuck, Agabucci's Agabucci. or some Agabucci. shit? Mm, I don't know if it was the. I forget what the company was. Uh, yeah, you yeah, 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 tell us more. You'd remember who, who it was. No, I don't remember who it was, but I can tell you this much: it was at the Springfield Country Club. <laughs> was it big so, all right, so this is what happened. How was the what was the phrase Fat Farm used? P H A T P H I R M. This is what happened. So, my mother signed me up for it. Because her friend was the one running it, and no, none of the guys wanted to do it. So I get a thing sent to me at school saying you have to be down here at this time right after school. And I'm like, oh, the hell this is! And I find out it's what I had to go there to do learn how. how did to you get trapped on a casting couch? That's a different story. Different story. Uh, but so lo and behold, I'm the only guy that signs up for this thing. I have to take dance classes because there's like a dance part to it. It was terrible. And then I got in a lot of trouble because I was supposed to go for a fitting that I never went to. So pretty much I it was a the, the theme was the night at the movies. And I had to play King Kong. Oh, <laughs> oh I love this. It, it was such it was such a stretch. Uh yeah, no, just I like had your a, suit, just like your suit, such a stretch. Yes, just like my suit. Um, so I had to dress up like King Kong. We and need, so we need a bald kid that looks like an ape. Who do we got? No, I had hair. Got? It flowed. I had a quaff. It, it flowed. Look at the balls on this one. <laughs> <laughs> but the best part is, I literally almost scared the shit out of every person there because, so the the runway was you know the long narrow runway, and in the middle like more of a box, kind of like a little bit more room. So I was supposed to pick the like girl. A tea? Yeah. No. The more like a box in the middle of a long runway. It wasn't gravity okay. that killed the beast. It was diabetes. <laughs> It was high blood sugar. Uh, <laughs> so I, at, at that God. point, we had a. So I had to learn two dances. One was the dirty dancing dance, and the other one was this one. I don't even know what they called it. Um, Patrick, La- Patrick Lazy. 
Is that your, your? I thought you were King Kong. Yeah. Right? Now you're doing well, no, that was King Kong. There was the two <laughs> dances. That was the second one. King Kong so I had to pick lips. this girl up. Yeah. Oh, I had to pick her up and then walk her around and just, like swing her around. But apparently, because I couldn't see out of the mask, <laughs> my one foot came off the stage. <laughs> But luckily, I didn't put pressure down, so it like swung off, but came back on. She and, never walked again. And the whole place is like, <gasps> like just like stop, like this gasp. Oh so God. yeah, I'm fat. <laughs> LT, what were you in? Uh, were you in actual catalogs that they mailed out when you were younger? No, nothing. No. You didn't make anything. No. Oh. You just you just would do it, and okay. I won a contest though before Explain. for modeling. Explain. Uh, I was at Egypt nightclub. Oh, of course you were. <laughs> yeah. What was shampoo like overbooked? <laughs> yeah. I was too young. I was oh, too young okay. to get in shampoo. I don't think anyone's too young to go in shampoo. <laughs> and they were doing a modeling contest for Don Casablanca's, and me and my girlfriend entered it, and I won first place. Oh, nice. So then we had to go to Don Casablanca's. We had to model for them, but then you had to sign up and pay money to be in it. Of course, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Listen, you won. But you got to buy a five thousand dollar photo shoot. Right. You won the chance did, to pay. And you got to and you got to fly yourself to Honolulu to take the pictures. Did, and you got to buy our ticket too. Did yeah. your Did your girlfriend, who you went with, did she like secretly resent you because you got it and she didn't? No, because she signed up and she actually did pictures with them. Oh, oh. so she, she she paid the seven thousand dollars. She, she paid. <laughs> <laughs> paid. You don't what? got what it takes, but you got seven K. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what do they want you to model? Clothes. Like the strand of clothes? Yeah. Like, like a cattle? Like, okay. Yeah. Like, it's just, wait, what was it? John Casablanca's? Yeah. I don't know what that is. Like I don't know if it exists anymore. Yeah, no, that's that. The, that was the modeling company. Oh, I thought it was like a that brand. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Didn't they go to like the malls and stuff like yes. that? Like they would be like they would sit there. Like, they, the, the creepy guy in the yeah. like, the, the wrinkled suit would modeling. come out. Yeah. You got a face for modeling, you kid. Come on over. You couldn't do My that sister today. that put me on this show actually used to model for them too. Oh, oh okay. yeah. So you got like a family full of hotties. Is pretty much what you're throwing out there. I mean, maybe. Well, maybe okay. <laughs> okay. Right. So you. How number one? How did you find out about this maxing contest? I saw it on Facebook. Just like don't go live. Mm-hmm. And it so it just it found its way. Zuckerberg found its way into your mini feed. Definitely did. And you were like, I want to do this. Well, I read about it and I thought it would be really great for somebody that I'm trying to help. Understood. And what can you tell us about this person? Number one, explain like what the actual contest is for. So the contest basically is for the wounded warriors. Okay. They're trying to raise money for them. So when it, you see to buy a vote, the money goes towards them okay. to help rebuild their homes and everything. Yeah, we saw it was the Jared Allen's project for uh, rebuilding and renovating homes for soldiers. Yeah, which could be you know just houses in disrepair, and you got to remember some of them come back wounded that need their shit to be made all handicap accessible and all that shit. And uh, I believe it's Jared Allen. It's the football player, right? I I, I believe it so. Yeah. It just made, it yeah. would make sense. The it was defensive end, yeah. right? Yeah. 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 So yeah, that's that's pretty rad. So you saw that, and you're just like, I uh, know someone who uh, you know I can attach this to. Yes. And I'm gonna go do it. Yes. And you clicked on the link, I assume. Mm -hmm. And so Zuckerberg already got you. Yep. And sure now did. Maxim gets you. And did it cost any money to enter this? No. Okay, that's good. So just name, age, where you live, date of birth. Where'd you say you lived? In Folsom. You said in Folsom. You okay. say Philadelphia. No. Good okay. for you. Good You're going to you. win this. <laughs> so, all right. Good so you, you. you don't model, but you saw this link and you wanted to click on it. What what made you go, yeah, that's the one I want to do? That's what I want to do? Yeah. Like, what was it the wound, like the, what, because of the wounded warrior part or was it just because no, it was, it was like 25K? It I'm was, not saying yeah. yeah. It was yeah. the 25K. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah. Just making yeah. sure. Oh, yeah. Wait, you get 25K if you win. What? You get 25K if you win. Yes. That's pretty rare. Yes. <laughs> yes. But I'm not going to use it on myself. Okay. Mm -hmm. She's gonna buy you a shirt holder, right? So, <laughs> a shirt that fits and doesn't have stains. Yeah. So I saw the the buy of somebody who can spend. So that's kind of on. That's a personal thing. I'm yeah, I'm taking it. Um, not so much. They've just been going through a lot and like medical bills and stuff. Yeah, like that's yeah, and okay. medical things and yeah, they're just looking for help and. Actually, the help that they need is going to cost about twenty five thousand. Oh. So oh, I thought that was perfect, and why not try? It's a sign, a little serendipitous. Mm -hmm. It's a sign. Yeah. 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 Uh, so for those who are watching, I did post in both the YouTube and the Facebook chat. There's the link. 
So you can click on it now or later or as many times as you can to vote. Uh, right now, as of the last time I checked, do it. She's a first. She's oh, currently man. first in her group. And this whatever ends, that means in her group, but she is first. And this ends on Thursday. Groups. Yes. At we looked it up. It is 7 p.m. Pacific time, which we did whip out Wikipedia and the internet. <laughs> Just Shout that. Out. Nothing that else. Means 10 o'clock. <laughs> we had to Google too, guys. <laughs> 10 p.m. here is where it ends. We had to learn a whole bunch about time zones and all this other shit and daylight mm -hmm. savings time. It ends at 10 p.m. here. After a two-hour Googling, we yes. figured out it ends at 10. People taking off their socks and shoes and shit. Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. We were originally going to say four because like, it speeds up, right? And we're like, no, it's on an airplane. It doesn't go that way. Yeah, I saw the groups. So what, what's, the, what's the groups? I'm not actually sure. I think there's different groups of 20, mm. 20 different groups. Okay. And I'm not sure how they put us all in my group. But I'm wondering if it's like a seated thing, you know, it gets of. lower and lower each okay. round. So um, Helen says she's voting every day. Yeah. Well, that's right. the thing. Is right, it, but she didn't say for who she just said she's voting. No, Helen. <laughs> she's Helen, like, I'm I voting hope you're for, voting for me. Yeah, She just says I'm voting <laughs> every day. I voted for the goth with the gun. <laughs> That would be like the second time he said that this week. I know. I'm going to start sliding my chair further. That's, <laughs> that's a normal reaction. <laughs> it's usually the smell, yes. but I guess this time around it was. No, it's the smell too. I am not. I am not crisp today. <laughs> Are you crisp any day? It has, been a, it has been a week. It has been a weekend. It has been a Monday. Uh, and one other question uh, Chris Hoops wants to know. Are there Tanzanians voting in so, this? They want to mm, know. If they have to. If they have to do it, they have to do it. I was going to say, this is yet another episode of Delco Live where we're talking about buying votes. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Helen wants to go, of course I am. I babysat you. Is this recently she babysat you? Yes. Just making I'm sure. I'm so ashamed to say that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> no, it's Thursday. Just kidding. <laughs> I was going to say, we're going from My show. wife actually finds the babysitter for me, but like just doesn't tell me out loud. Like. She like looks at like my thirteen year old. You're in charge. When she walks out the door, I'm like, all right. So you enter. So all right. So these these shots you have, they're like glamour shots. Like they're you know remotely professionally done. Where did you go to get these? The pictures. Yeah. So most of them I took myself. Oh. <laughs> oh, fancy! What iPhone is that? Mm, it's an eleven. Okay. Mm. Mm. Just the finest. I mean, <laughs> so you really took like all those like yourself? Like, Most of them. Are you saying? Are you gonna give the phrase? Are you gonna say hashtag no filter? Sure. Oh. No filter. No filter. Your no. your favorites too. I wanted. Are you have a favorite? You have like one favorite image that you had to give them? Like say, hey, use this as my featured. No, the they picture pick? that just came up was the picture. I guess that they, they loaded chose first. They loaded, they loaded yeah. first. It was the yeah. first one to pop in. It was like, that's really um so uh jamie ann says i have to ask you for a haircut she's the best hairdresser could you do something for me sure yeah could you do something for al wow yeah. it's could such you, it's such a you shame can you, can you, you really polish scale. this dome up two a out bit? of three guys here bald as, as anything yeah and, but <laughs> you have that you can make up with it on him i had a man bun last until night until you cut his hair and then give up well, i, I feel if she cuts home books hair she'll give up on her profession I, I would have brought you one. I know. I was thinking about that as soon as I he calls it a hair dewy. He's just trying to show off right now. What the man bun? <laughs> I, I have the post the picture posted online right now. I've it's seen it actually. I did see it actually. Oh, uh, up here we go. Here's the sister, the the driving force behind this interview. <laughs> she today. is a sharing machine. I know, Krista Ann. This is the sister. I like how she said this. This is the sister. This is the third sister. <laughs> She is the sister. You look amazing. And you said she was oh, also thanks, modeling Kristen. at one point, too? <laughs> yeah, she was. Oh, okay. Is she talking to me? I'll tell you what. We she, have to, like... She was. Me, me Al, Spaz, all of us, we have to, like, be in, like, every, like, community page group just because we run the show and all that stuff and have to, you know, see what's going on. Um, in the community. In the community pages. <laughs> and uh, Krista Ann has been in every single one of them <laughs> and has been literally my entire mini feed for like the last couple hours and it's she's she's a champion we love her for she that. she's a champion she's literally a she's better a marketer than supporter. i was just gonna say she's like a she's, your number one cheerleader she really you is know? It's awesome i know Please i gotta tell my husband every day did you vote yeah you so, have to tell what, him what, yeah. what, what about he finally goes yeah but i'm not telling you for who oh you're, <laughs> you're, you're married chick. so Oh, there goes my next eight questions. Quick question. Hold on. Wait, so, are you ma happily married? Ask him. Oh! Just kidding, yes. <laughs> Holbrook knows the guy can handle that for you. Yeah. Um, but so Kathy Gibson Gallagher wants to know she needs her hair did. Where could she get it done at if she wanted you to do it? She said, please cut his hair. Oh, she said his. All right. I, I was trying to plug for you, but you just. And Glenn Mills. 
Yeah. It's Route 1 at Cheney Road. Right is that next near to the Dunkin' old Donuts. Is it near the old Hooters? Ooh. Is it near the Buffalo uh, Wild Wings? Kind of, yeah. Uh, it's near it's the down the road. Is it's it before that. Sky Zone. Be- yeah. The weird part where it gets really windy and all the like teenagers die every year. Uh, uh, we don't want to that. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> That's kind of scary. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Come to my oh. shop. I'm right around the corner for all Name the Name one other landmark uh, in that area. <laughs> This is why he's not the marketer, by the way. <laughs> Joseph Anthony Salon is right up the road, and we're right down the street. That's that's a hike. It just sounds like a that's salon a hike, district. Yeah. No. A little bit. It seems hyper competitive with salons down this area. From up here. Are you near Britain Lake? Yes. Okay, I know where that is. Britain Lake is up the road. Ah, that's, that's right so there. So if you go to that's Britain Lake, far. you went too far. Okay. So uh, question. Okay. Dolan... You know where the prison is? Uh, yes, we do. We go. are very yeah. familiar there with George W. Hill go. Correctional so Facility in Thorndale. So before you make that right to go up to the prison, uh, I'm in the shopping center. Oh, you said Cheney Road. That's, yeah. Ah, uh, yes, that is, yeah. That's why Holbrook needed a hairdo. He wasn't listening. You are, <laughs> no, you're, you're a quick, you're a quick learn. <laughs> she, she said prison, Holbrook's like, oh, no. uh, yes. Gotcha. Ah, uh, Brent Lake. So, oh, the prison, yes. So Dolan's Bar saying they need an official hottie for social media. So which one of the four of us were you looking for exactly? Yeah. What? I was just trying to make sure he, he said an official hottie, so I didn't know. Really didn't say whom. Oh my god, creep, creep in on my DMs, Don. You know my, <laughs> you know my name. You know my number. Are right, you getting a lot of love, Teresa? Here, Krista is the bomb. Thank you, thank you, nineteen ninety eight. Uh, <laughs> love you, Har. <laughs> love yeah. you, Jess. All right, so this Max thing, you signed up, all that stuff. You went through all this stuff. You submitted your own pictures and all that shit. How much did they? How, how many pictures did they want? They don't say. You can you okay. can put more. You can delete some. You can post new ones. Oh. So I recently added some new ones too. Okay. Mm. You ever think about like going to like a professional or anything? Not saying the pictures you have currently are bad, but like everybody's telling me to. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, I mean, don't. I mean, it's working. You're in first place right You're now. You're in first place. So let's start with that. Well, well, I think th- the first place is from all the voters. Do you want I have to? a lot of support? What do yeah. you want? Do you feel like you need to go and get professional pictures, or do would you want to? I do not. No, okay. not right now. I think, I, natural... I think I just need to be me. Nope, and also, if you're representing Delco and you're, the fact that you're in first place anyway, it actually, the naturalness of it is, like, good because we were looking at it. We saw you. You were number one. Then we started looking at the other ones. And it's like, yeah, it's like boudoir photos, but it's just like, ew. Like, yeah. There's, yeah. like, I've They're never seen beautiful. a bad boudoir photo. There were. There were. <laughs> uh, oh, look, I, I should your boudoir photos. I am, not a looker, I am not a physical specimen, but I will tell you, there are some people who should not be in the contest in your group. Well, I'm not going to ask you, but I think they're all beautiful. Oh. In their own way, yes. yes. There's a few. So if this modeling thing doesn't work out, she'll be a politician, apparently. <laughs> yeah. They're all beautiful. In the I race. don't know about that. They're all beautiful from the inside. <laughs> you also you also seem like the only one from, like, not only, like, this area, but the only one from, like, the north. I think there is another girl from Philly. Oh, bitch. I do. She's very pretty. We're going to bathe in We should tears. go to Dolan's and set up a celebrity fight. <laughs> There's with a you tremendous two. amount from the South. Uh, I don't you know, know about that. You, you know, you're a lover, <laughs> so, not a fighter. So you're yes. not worried about the competition at all? I am worried. There's a couple couple um, of girls that I saw in I'm there. I'm very nervous. Yeah. I, I said. What? There's a couple girls in the competition. There, there is. Do you want to get into those? The, I mean, the ones that we might that make things anymore. a little stiff? Talk about that. Yeah, we'll talk about the competition. Yeah. All okay. right. So hold All on. Right. So. Well, I'm a little worried for you. Actually. Oh, damn. Yeah, I know. I know. Yeah, like you said, to keep updating their photos. You know. I pulled a couple. I pulled a couple of your Here, Here's your first one. I, he's okay. right. I don't, I don't Let's see. Who he got. Got. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. This is, this is uh, uh, Big Al, <laughs> Big Alyssa Mulatto. From uh, Marcus Hook. Wait, is that really Al's? Yeah, it's Al's. <laughs> it's sad because it works. It looks too real. Al, you look like Lena Dunham got hot. <laughs> <laughs> you look like Lena Dunham tried. That's Big Al Melissa Mulatto. So, uh, she, he, she enjoys buffets. Why is your Fast food crawls down Baltimore Pike and Nutella. Your hair looks like something from like Super Doug or the Rugrats. Superpower. Everybody had to give their superpower. Uh, Alyssa's is no gag reflex. <laughs> that's that's a, that's Alyssa's superpower. This is disturbing. I worry. It's so real. I worry about her a little bit. Lt. Okay, who do you got next? Oh, uh, let's see. This is now this one. Or you may not be in first place long with this one. Please don't tell me it's. <laughs> oh my goodness! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. I love the Fupa. This is, Chris- laying down. <laughs> is that me? This is Christina oh. broke asshole from Yaden. <laughs> Christina enjoys fried. <laughs> 
Christina Broga so enjoys fried foods, foot massages, and chocolate covered anything. And she means anything. Christina, my feet look like ballet shoes. I assume the, I assume the toes were lost in the diabetes. <laughs> What the fuck was your original part of this? What did you type into my this picture? It's like, like this, this is for Spaz's personal it collection. Like it looks like he's got the spit like chewing tobacco all over the place. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, it looks like super. David Company literally just ate like an entire jar of salt. What do you, LT, what do you think Christina uh, is superpower is? Just hmm. looking at her. <laughs> I'm unsure. Okay. Well, Christina's superpower is she can smell a cheesesteak from three miles away. <laughs> Jamie's saying you should wax her, Laura. <laughs> oh my God. Where do you start? Jamie, I'll let you comment on this in a little bit. That, like, where where funny. do you start waxing? It's your face. Oh, God. It's your face. Maybe the brows. It's, a, it's, a, it's Christine. <laughs> I think I need a microblading. The, 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 the most... The most screwed up part of this is that this is not the worst picture of Holbrook I've ever seen. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Like and share if you think this is a good looking picture of Christina. Yeah. I All think right. Christina has socks on. They might be a little dirty. <laughs> yeah. I don't need to wash my feet. Oh, that All is right. just. Is, uh, Who needs shoes when you got feet scum? Yeah. This is a crime. I, I, have a, I have a problem. I wear out all the soles in my shoes real quick. <laughs> this is a crime against humanity. My God. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Oh, this is this is Louise Diamond Pull-Ups. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Louise Diamond Pull-Ups? Louise Diamond Pull-Ups uh, from Swarthmore. Uh, Louise enjoys making custom COVID masks, blowing bubbles on his friends, and cheese platters. <laughs> Louise's superpowers is blocking out the sun. <laughs> Dude, those legs just remind me of, like, Easter dinner with a good old ham. <laughs> Oh, I'll tell you, that's Prof. He's not here tonight. That's our other guy on the show. Yeah. He hates Lou Diamond Phillips, so that's why we put his name as Louise Diamond Pull-Ups. <laughs> and he shits himself a lot, so. He shits himself a lot. Yeah. yeah. But uh, well, watch out for Louise. And, uh... Remember, that competition is brought to you by David R. Cherry at 610-565-0300. <laughs> for all your workers' cop motor vehicle, personal injury, and criminal law needs. Is slander and libel? Yeah. yeah. He will now. There was one he more. Will... Wasn't there one more? I had... Three. Oh no, there is. Hold on. You're right. More, You're dude. right. This is a competition. Don't be selling them. You're sure. right. Hold on. Hold on. I got it right here. Ready? This is. Uh, I think you forgot Amanda. <laughs> no, but this is. Uh... <laughs> I like... There's a. <laughs> oh. I screw this up. This is just a. Yeah. There's another one. Hold on. I'll. I'll come back to you. Okay. Never mind. I got it. Well, we've already seen that other one now. <laughs> All right. We'll do that. Go back to. Go back to. Christina broke asshole. <laughs> Okay, watch out for them three. I mean, not in the competition. I was going to say, are they allowed to have three versus one in this situation? Are they trying to jump in? I think that was Alyssa Mulatto right there. (laughs) Yeah, there's only four in here, dude. PJ looks like like PJ a little bit. What do you think, P? Is the one on the right Prophet? Yes. He looks like the burly guard for the Sultan in Aladdin. (laughs) That's, That's Al on the left. Holbrook in the middle and profit on the right. What was the name on this one? Because there's all good. There was one of me because I don't. All right, you put it in a different folder. I it's think I got good. it. No, I, I got it. I got it. Hold on. Oh. Not me. It wasn't of me. It was Amanda Suckoff, I think. <laughs> Here we go. You ready? There she is. Oh, That's man. Amanda. Amanda from Radnor. She enjoys donuts, <laughs> sampling free food at BJ's Wholesale Club, and donuts, <laughs> and, and bathing in scrapple. Oh, that makes sense. Superpower is that she can queef on command. <laughs> her, uh, she literally has a butt crack as her stomach. <laughs> yeah, how do you? She's do totally that? sucking it. And in. she clearly got that hair dye to look like Wendy from Wendy's. Yeah, <laughs> and she did not go to Edora. No. So do you think you stand a chance against those like heart throbs right there? Maybe. Oh, I mean, wow. those are pretty popular. They got Tanzania voting. You want to rethink your statement good. of everybody's beautiful? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wax, no, wax the nose hairs too. first. Uh, that was uh, pleasantly disturbing. Prof is still hot as a girl. Prof was really ecstatic in that picture. <laughs> he actually, you, I, I was trying to find one because you would appreciate it. He dressed like um, Snooky, I believe. From, okay. uh, oh my God. Sure. I'm sure. And he got into it with the, uh, what was he oh. wearing? Oh. 
profit. Thong? Yeah, he's he wearing... shit a thong. <laughs> yeah. Which his description of like the 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 act of shitting a thong was just I can't unpicture it now. It's disgusting. He shared on Facebook and it got flagged. Yeah. That who did? Uh, profit. He got yeah. flagged for what? Putting that fi- picture of him in Snooky on Facebook. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder if your sis is like, "Oh shit, what did I get her into?" <laughs> this scene that. So, how many people are in your group? Like, we obviously know at least like twenty. I think there's forty eight, but I'll say so it right now. far from what I've seen. But okay. I think it's going to get lowered. Yeah, definitely. And do they are they keeping like little like are they keeping, fifty? Like, there's top, fifty people. In fifty in each group. Yeah, at least this group, I can tell you that much. Okay, okay. fifty. We stopped. Like, I stopped doing it for like twenty. Um. Especially because, boy, after eight, does it drop off? No, actually, I I fell in love with number thirteen, the uh, the goth with the gun. Yeah, <laughs> she's just sitting there with a gun in her hand, like it's her profile. This is she's the just, third like, time he that. said that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> she's interesting. He's in love. He's in love. Yeah. She'll awesome. be on next week's show. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> on next week's show, I mean, we got you might gun have gun to start girl. Reaching out. Uh, I mean, it's, no if way. you like run into her down the road, like let me know. She <laughs> she was very she looked very traumatized. <laughs> And look like she was trying to traumatize others as well. She, she may. Or because I think for traumatized girls, yeah, find some easy marks. Fear, <laughs> fear is a turn on to me. <laughs> I don't mind. No. Um, okay. so, so let me can let me let me ask a question real quick. Yeah. So when you saw this ad and because so, yeah, I'm sure you didn't just see it and click on it. Go for it, right? Yeah, you had she to. Said she did that. Well, <laughs> I'm guessing that you probably talked it over with your hubby. I did not. You didn't. So no. you signed you said, up. Effa, I'm just going right for it. I talked to one of my girlfriends about it. Mm. Good for you. We we should, you should that. put that in that little profile above your oh. name, like you know, on the on the page. I didn't even ask my husband for this. Hell <laughs> like, yeah. Like I think that'll get you another 15, 20 votes easily. I Maybe. I told him after I signed up and put my pictures up. His reaction. He was happy. Yeah. He said, go for Dude, it. Of, oh, all right. All right. Listen, if my <laughs> If my wife's like, like modeling, of course, I'm like, yeah, it's my wife. She's modeling. It's her. She's with me. I don't know why. She whips, like, you know, like I'm just sitting there, like, get I'm, out of here. I call bullshit right now. If she put up, if if she put up pictures online right away, you wouldn't just say, oh, you could, you would, uh, you wouldn't want to ask her. No, no. Should be when you get to go. Hold on, hold on, I like how your voice just went up. Your can, yeah, can, can yeah. we can we just back it up? Yeah. Of all the dumb shit that I do on a weekly basis. That I don't ask for. I have no right ever to question anything she does. I am 39 years old and I act like a 12 year old. There is never like I cannot think of a reason like that. Like I, I can't think of a good reason that I'm like, babe, you should have asked me first to do something like this. I mean, unless it costs us like a lot of money, like she's like, oh, I'm gonna go buy a new car or house. Like, yeah, okay, ask me. Let's discuss this first. But she wants to sign up for modeling. I'm like, hell yeah, my wife's modeling. So right. you win, you get to go like, yeah, I'm dating a December Maxim magazine. Oh my god, and that, that's the, I'm telling you, I don't know oh, your yeah. husband, I don't know him, I've never met him, I don't even see the picture of him. I'm telling you right now, that is the first goddamn thing that popped in his head. He's sitting there going, Yeah, when she wins, I can tell everybody, I'm, yeah, I'm banging Maxim magazine. Ah, <laughs> uh, maybe the 25k probably would have won. That's, that's just that's icing a, on the cake. Uh, I'm telling you, if he's anything like Al's, me, Al's excited. He it's, the, talk about it, cake. it's the magazine. <laughs> Al's more excited about the cake. It's the cake He's yeah. distracted now. He's the the Maxim cake. Hey. I look how you're, you're, you went up like three octaves. Hey. I'm going to play poker with you. I can't wait. You got a good hand now? Yeah. <laughs> all right. So, Yannard, was there any criteria besides like B18 and all that stuff? No. Okay. So, like, do we, do we have any rough estimate about like how many people have entered so far? Thousands. One thousand. Oh, thousands. I think thousands. Even in the fifties. Okay, so yes. twenty groups, and then probably like fifty groups of fifty. Okay. Um. Okay. And there is no rhyme or reason behind who's in each bracket. I am not sure. I, I think it may be H. Okay. Age. I'm thinking. Are you yeah. around thirty-one years old? Maybe. Okay, because the only ages I specifically saw in there was like two people said they were thirty-one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm a little older. Okay. 31 I, uh, and a half. I'm a lot older. So don't worry. About it. Yeah. <laughs> I said I was 39 like six times already. So you yeah, guys know I'm, I'm 39. Older. <laughs> we, we did stalk the first like 20 people like competition. You you are going to stand a good chance in, in <laughs> your bracket. And uh, so when did this round start? This round started. Oh, gosh, I forget. 
last week. Oh, so, okay. So or, like rapid fire. Yes. Okay. It's really fast. Okay. It's every single day. Vote, vote, vote. Every 24 hours. Yeah. Um, yeah, you can buy votes. It will go towards the wounded warriors. So How? you're not just buying votes for me. Right. It will help me. Right. But you're putting money towards them. Well, the Tanzanians also. buy votes. I totally want to help the wounded warriors, but the getting Delco on the cover of Maxim. Yeah. Delco there on the cover yeah. of Maxim is a, even a great. Well, it's like Delco. Thing. It's like Delco Day. We want to do something awesome, but also the money going to charity is awesome too. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. that's true, Al. But we can also get Delco on the cover of Max. Yeah, exactly. We want uh, Jillian LT saying L L the front page, Al. We want Elk. Think about the, the fucking cover. headline. Jillian saying age is a number. Yes, you know this, Jill. Jillian. Age is a number. We're well aware of this. <laughs> Says cholesterol, Al. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Laura will win. Damn straight, she's gonna right. win. You tell him, Lord. Is it right, the Lord? Lord? Andrew. He so, is the Lord. Lord Andrew. He actually is a Lord. Is that who's on praising all the time? That guy, Andrew. <laughs> oh Lord, praise Andrew. So oh, that's what my wife's calling out. Okay. All right. So the the next round starts at ten o'clock on Thursday. Yeah. How many? I mean, so if we're going like. Like uh, it sounds like you're talking about ten day cycles of like these these. The these next round will go June 23rd to the 30th. Seven days, okay. Mm -hmm. And it goes into July, and you're saying this runs to August. This one began the 13th, 13th. till Thursday. Okay, 13th to so 10 days and seven days uh, every week, Ooh. every week on the week until August 8th, pretty much. 18th or. Oh, well, and 18th. August 18th, they will announce the winner. That's a long tournament. I know, guys. Keep voting. Oh, that's yeah. a well, long I'll check in with tournament. you like sometime right. in July and see how you're doing. Right. Remind everybody to vote. Yeah. You know? Who else have you, like, what other media platforms have you reached out to? I have actually reached out to Fox 29. They love us. They will steal it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> they will steal it, but then they will actually come through. No, they did steal it. They did show <laughs> Fox 29. Yeah. Uh, what's that girl's name? The little. Don't, 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 don't speak her name right now. Say her name. Oh, uh, the one that the one that the one that runs around like a like a little kid sniffing fun dip. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't stand it. Don't say her name. Did they get back? To you? No. Who are you talking about? No, it's a long um, story. Who, who did they get back? Nobody to you? got back to me. You, but I reached out to the actual Fox 29 and Alex Holly. So if you're watching, oh, it's not Alex Holly. I'm sure she's lovely. Yeah. She's beautiful. Yeah, Chris, o not Chris O'Connell, it's, great. They're all great. Chris O'Connell is the one. Except for you the should one. reach out to him because he is a Delco guy. Yeah. Joe right. Holden at, at, at uh, CBS is helping us out yeah. a lot too. Um, I watch Fox 29 every day. So, so. do I. I so do they betrayed me. Yes, <laughs> I do not. We uh we just had that event Delco Day and we like wrote to like every like media outlet and we were like yo like six ten and stuff they were put on the books it's all to help this benefit like uh you know at Marty McGee's it's to help out this family like any chance you could help us out and every single person was like ignore or like fuck you that's stupid that's stupid we're not gonna waste our time on that then we wake up June tenth and every single channel is like it's six ten it's Delco Day the greatest thing ever what the fuck's a Delco yeah. Live we don't care yeah. fuck them well that's not entirely true no a lot of them did come through at the end yeah. well I'm also saying there are people that did respond back to us that said that they would donate and then just never donated. And then just, and but then yet it, but yet they plaster and they they hoard a name Delco out all over the place. It's it's quite manning. That's another show. Well that's so, when you gotta call them out. Yeah. Well that's oh. that's gonna happen. Publicity. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, I don't want we don't want to speak their name, give them anything, but so we're uh, here about you tonight. tonight Charlene tonight. Nicole says we got you. Rob can text Bob Kelly. That's right, Charlene. We can, we came to Putt Putt and he's like BFFs now. Yes, well, Rob. Fun fact about uh, Bob. Putt -Putt. Yeah. Al, if there's ever been a good segue. Well, who do you think set that up for you, pal? <laughs> <laughs> Al, speaking of Putt Putt. Hi. Oh my goodness, is it the fourth annual already of the oh. Delco Masters? Four years in running, might I add. Four years in running. Not, I don't like this. This wasn't started two weeks ago. No, 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 no. no, no, no. This no, is four no, years in no, running. No. Yeah. Just no, run it out there. This years, years ago, pre-pandemic. Pre-pandemic. Yeah, we weren't just using it as a name, and it started for charity and all yeah, that shit. No, and, like, I gave it to charity, and it was nice. And uh, what it is is, it's uh, you know, the Masters. It's you know, uh, it is at Putt Putt in <laughs> Clifton Heights, where champions are bred and made. Yeah, yes. The the harsh green felt of Clifton Heights. Yeah. And the, the champions either going to get. Uh, we haven't figured out if it's going to be orange or green, but it's definitely going to be a flannel jacket. 
It has yeah. to be green flannel jacket. Yeah. Well, It'll I know. Yeah, jacket. but the orange goes with Clifford. But we'll, we'll, okay, we'll do the green flannel jacket, okay? So it's a blast. Apparently we'll we it figured that. it out right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, the orange is a nod to Clifton. Right? So right now it is scheduled for August 12th. Oh, no, it is August 12th now. But I'm saying it's Rain scheduled. or shine. Yes, August 12th. Uh, it's a Friday. Uh, tee off will be at 8. And then, oh, part- no, no, you got to be there by 7 30 and fucking logged in. Yes, but so the tee tea- off will be at eight. And this is what I deal with all the time, by the way. Yeah, and- there'll be more info on that. Yeah. And, like and then, and at- then there'll be a two hour open bar for all contestants at the Delco Cup right Delco. down the street. Formerly the Stanley Cup, formerly the second place, the runner up for the most Delco bar the first time. Yes. LT, what are you doing? You think you can make it out? Maybe we could drum up some votes around that I time? do. I'll be around. Yeah, that's yes. actually, that's actually that's... literally six days before her six voting. Days, it's six days before the end. If we get 50, drum up more votes, if we what get we'll 50 do? people, there's 50 people, and then they can all buy votes. There's 100 votes right there. And... We'll do. We'll bring like a little iPad or something so they can log in and vote. They have to vote before they yeah, we'll, tee off. Yeah, we'll put it. We'll yeah. We'll, we'll put a weapon the head. up against their head and yeah. make them at the iPad sit and vote for you. Yeah. Do I have to now play we would not do that. That was a joke. Huh? Do you, are you guys playing pop Yeah. 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 Do I have to? Are you, you I mean, I'm pretty pop-up? good. <laughs> You'd be surprised, like how can people I pick like... my ball? Yeah. <laughs> I, prefer, I, guess, I yeah. usually pick the pink one, but yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's, they don't have zebra, so they don't have zebra. So hopefully, has to go with the hot pink. I'm like bring one this year. I the thing is, we probably should get our own balls, yeah. like Delco Live balls. You yeah. think you can get it's on? Splash, you do, but do you you do putt putt when you're a kid? I did. Yeah, do you do I still as do as an adult. Yeah, you yeah. do. <laughs> right on. Um. Now think it like this is like literally the best adult party with drink. Yeah. We can't drink on the golf course. We're not dr- it's a non drinking. <laughs> <event. Nice. Yeah. laughs> We're not drinking. That's what your caddy. You might want to talk to Rob about that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Who's Rob? Oh, yeah. Rob and Charlene. Can, 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 Rob owns Putt Putt. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know. He, we talked to him, and you know, we can't drink. We're not drinking. <laughs> We're not drinking. Putt Putt. Right. We talked. We talked, uh, we talked to Rob. When you say yeah. it out loud, Laura. I'm robbing a bank right now. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know why about. we're all doing this, but uh, I want to be part. <laughs> I got arthritis <laughs> from doing this too much <laughs> now. I'm going now, to uh, murder someone. Yeah, uh, we uh, maybe do a. Uh, um, we talked about doing a costume contest. <laughs> What? Like, I, 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 is that what I just did? No. He's gonna be Godzilla, a co- right? A costume concert? What? Him? King Kong? King Kong? King Kong. Yeah, I'll do King Kong. Uh, two girls, one. <laughs> two two girls, one. Oh okay. my god. Yeah, can you bring your people out? Your sister and all that shit. All your new fans. <laughs> Absolutely. Pack the place. We're gonna Absolutely. dress. We'll yeah. send you the link. That dress is gonna win something. I don't know what it's gonna be. But you gotta dress like you're actually on the Masters. And there'll be real prizes too. Dawn was Dawn was the best dress last year. Gone, yeah, she looked like Jagger Vance. Yeah. Um, well, I don't know. It's between her and uh, uh Ron. Ron, Ron. Ron. He was dressed Ron. like he literally went out Ron. and bought the Happy Gilmore right. hockey oh butter. Yeah, like he spent like three hundred dollars to get a scent like that next day. <laughs> He's he went he went the furthest. So it, it's a top toss up. I was just gonna say, Ron. Yeah, we will have Ron. a best dressed award for you. Yeah, we have a surplus of weird trophies coming in because we we ran into a good connection for some weird trophies. But anyway, we keep it. Well, actually, we weren't distracted. That was a great product placement and a good tie in. We actually did it finally. It took four years. We're actually getting like good at this. Thanks, oh, Laura. my God. This Laura, is- you're, the, you're the reason we're actually yeah. good at this now. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Inspiration. Inspiration. So <laughs> this round ends Thursday, and then you go into a new bracket. Is it only the first place person out of your bracket? Then? No. Oh. So you can afford to lose some votes? No. No. Okay. Okay. You gotta keep That's them right. going. She's like, That's screw right. you, Holbrook. Every, every round. You can take that okay. shove it up your ass. Right. Right. How, many, how many go from each one? So the top 20, this is a top 20. So the, the next round, it will be 15 entrants. So I think the top 15 will be in the next round Okay. from each group. Okay. So you yes. are, knock on wood, essentially safe for the, through this. I sure hope so. It can change any well, minute. Well, it says first. She's, she's good. If it says she's in first yeah. on the web page. Today's Monday, though. So you, you think somebody's me- sitting like idly waiting just to start? Blasting boats. <laughs> so the goth with a gun could go to round two. Oh my god! Uh, I'm this... slowly Can you moving get her my chair. <laughs> She's gonna smack it. Is come on now. She's gonna pistol whip you with this gun if you keep your shit. Oh, you can be. I'll take. No, we're just like going through it. It's like you, and then like a boudoir photo, and then like a Sears like catalog photo, <laughs> and then it's just like this random like psycho chick with like no makeup, just holding a gun, and we're like. What's going on with that? There's one? one girl I swear has to be from Swarthmore. She's wearing the black long sleeve t shirt. Yeah. Like, I'm like, that is 
why you're modeling why are you wearing a long sleeve black t-shirt like i, I don't think get she's it. actually from another country oh that's her fault uh, she was so like she her was problem from Mozambique, which i had to i had to read for al because he didn't know how to pronounce it <laughs> yeah say yeah. it what is it i don't even know what was Just, it what's the country i forget what it was it's what was it again m-o-z-a-m Mozambique. it's right next to tanzania <laughs> is it Yes. Okay. I'm not good with geography. Is that like Arabs? I'm not good with geography, so is that's that why. A, is it an Arab country where they can't show skin? Is that like the, maybe the reason they're wearing? That is actually a very astute uh, point. I possibly possible lie. Well, Jamie Ann says her friends and cousins are coming, so woo boo. Hell yeah. All right, Jamie Ann. <laughs> that's Hell it, yeah. We're Hell holding you to it, Jamie Ann. Already got your credit card, so we're good to go. <laughs> Get out so there. they say where this, this shoot's going to be? France. France. You have the, oh, yeah. Do you have a passport? Yes. That's good. It takes a while to get. I was gonna say if you're gonna win. <laughs> oh, gonna don't tell there. me about the passports. I just dealt with that with my daughter and her boyfriend. Went to Italy. What a mess. Just what, you and well, at least one other. I'm saying. I'm thinking. Just me, but that's creepy. Definitely gonna have my husband come with. Yeah, me. you have to buy your own flight. I guess she's got twenty five no, grand. They, I guess she could do that. He, he they will. pay for the flight. They okay. pay for the stay. But do they, they pay, pay for, for his flight or your flight? No, just mine. Okay. I'm just gonna put it out there as someone who uh, grew up reading Maxim. A yeah, lot. Hold on, hold on. We've reading, got this. Reading. reading <laughs> I still may have the one with Shannon Elizabeth like framed in my room. Um, I don't really feel they do outdoor shots. Why does it have to be in France? It's usually just on a bed with like a teddy and fucking like a blanket. That's true. I'm not sure. I guess that's the location they picked. Yeah. So, Holbrook, why don't you ruin it for guys? Guess what? After watching uh, Lars Delco live episode, we're going to move it to Cincinnati, Ohio. Yeah. You know, Wilmington, Delaware on a bed in the middle of a creek. Here we go, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry. She's rubbing Delco. That actually sounds like it should be it now. <laughs> Only Holbrook can ruin it. should be the Darby Creek. Yeah, you Only Holbrook can ruin a girl's dream to go to I know. You just model. shit the bed on her bed like Amber Heard on Johnny Depp, <laughs> dude. Like, Have any of you been to France? No, no I assume true. it sucks. I assume it sucks. Anyway. They have nicer Fuck beds. Friends. They probably have nicer. I don't know about nicer there. beds, but it probably smells weird. They smell weird. It's definitely for Darby sure. smells weird. We could do it in Darby. Uh, just a thought. If by some crazy chance that you don't win, I say we go to France anyway and just bust up the uh, the shoot. Find a shoot. Yeah, we should start Delco. Yeah, we'll just start just... smashing cameras. <laughs> no, and bust shit. it up. Like ah, this is a world. This is Delco shoot. And the best part is we can write it as a business write off. So it's great. Yeah. There you go. There you go. So I should oh, go yeah. get a passport. <laughs> Alright, guys. Homer, do you have a passport? I, I, no. Because have you left Pennsylvania? Uh, well, he didn't want to vote for yes. me anyway, so yeah. he's not coming. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I, I'm gonna do not fly list. <laughs> No, no, it's the cannot fly list. Yeah, the cannot fly list. <laughs> <You're> fat ass. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> they cannot fly because I fucking spent all my money flying in 2016 and haven't paid it off yet. Where were you flying to? We did Chicago, New Orleans, Vegas. You know, I was coming off a breakup and decided to just travel to all the party cities and be a piece of shit. So you were just doing it not in Delco, being yes. a piece of shit. Yes. <laughs> He's like, let me expand my piece of shitness real yeah. quick. <laughs> I feel I have a gift I can share to the world, <laughs> the rest of this country. Oh god! I feel rather patriotic. I just went to go be a piece of shit in every time zone. Spreading your seed all over the land. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sick of being a problem in Nevada. I'd like to be a problem in Clark County, Nevada, right now. <laughs> yeah. You been to Vegas? No. I would love to go. Oh, that reminded me. Don't go with Holbrook. <laughs> Did you file the Johnny Depp Amber Heard thing? I did not. Okay. Did you hear about that? About she got mad and, and took a dump <laughs> on his side of the bed? Did you hear about that? I did. Okay. So I want to know what's the worst thing you ever did to an ex, either your husband or like an ex boyfriend? Mm. Like it it could not be as severe as taking a dump on, on their side of the bed. I don't think I did anything terrible no. to anybody. She just kills no, them to make sure I they just... never exist. Yeah, just said bye. Yeah, moved on. Bye, and somehow they just disappeared off the face of the earth. It was the craziest damn thing. Uh, I mean, well, I had to ignore them. <laughs> no spite, no kind of spite. No Nothing. pee in a car. No. Writing whore on the side yeah. of her, the new so girlfriend. So, I mean, there's was... thoughts, but I never did anything. <laughs> there's always thoughts. How long you been? How long? It. How long you been married? Seven years. Seven years. How long you been dating overall? Fourteen years. Fourteen. Cheese and rice. Um, where'd you hang out before you got booed up? Hmm. 
Let's see. Nothing's open anymore. That's where I was like <laughs> thinking. Yeah. Did you go to Rick's place a lot? I did not. No. Okay. She I, stopped when she was sixteen. Did you go to Dirty Nellie's? <laughs> I did. Of course you did. I went to Dirty Nellie's. I remember you. Now. I went to the city a lot. <laughs> Where'd you go in the city? A little mm. McGillin's. That is a that is a that we is a girl. girl. Of course you did. Buckheads. 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 Well, no, it was Tiki Bobs. It, it was. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. McFadden's. Uh, McFadden's. Mad River. Mad River. Of course. Uh -huh. Irish pub. Mm hmm. Uh, yep. So you had the I traditional was, Delco. Yeah, I was life. all over the place. Yes. Yeah, she left Delco every chance she got. Brownies. Are you doing when Went to Brownies in Ardmore. Of course, for Sink or Swim. <laughs> yeah. I'm actually going to Ardmore Music Hall this weekend. <laughs> RS Club. RS Club. I went there maybe once or twice. Where'd you, where'd you, where'd you get shot? And I fell walking down a step. No, you might have gotten shot walking down the last time I was there. Uh, it wasn't fall. Oh, it's not booty. Yeah, yeah, it's so bullish. Did you say <laughs> the, the bootleggers. Did you say bootleggers? I did not say bootleggers. Did you go bootleggers? bootleggers? Did you do bootleggers? Yeah. I was going to say, what, when you didn't the leave. Lagoon? Oh, of course. Uh, the so when you didn't right leave now. the county, where did you go? Like, what was your stopping grounds? When I could leave the when county. When you couldn't leave. If you had to stay local, like, you're like, I'm not driving, you know, hmm. not getting a DUI this time. Did you go to the Buck Tavern? No, no, Ridley. I've right? actually never. She's been like in there. about forty years too young for the Buck Tavern yeah. right now. What about Dino's? No, uh, I'm just thinking. You're Fal from Fal 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 oh, you're from Fall Crawl. Oh my God, the Falcon. Fall Crawl or Fall Song? Oh, grew... Julie said the Fal Shark Fal Club. Yes. Tell me you went to the Shark Club. <laughs> oh, there you go. I did. Oh God, oh, God. Jesus. <laughs> Julie just Shoot. let it out. Way to go, Jules. Shark Club was the fucking uh, the Jules. thrift shop that where like Chester Blake and McCabe meet. No, it was Barnaby. No, Barnaby. Barnaby. it was Barnaby. Yeah. It was the okay. It's, okay. it was the it's same the entrance for the Heritage. Room now. Yeah. It was, okay, it was Scooters before. Do you remember Scooters? Nah, it was a little before my time. Yeah. I went. I, I went to. <laughs> I went to the under or the the under twenty one night, like when I was nineteen or something like that. You're gonna say when you were thirty five. Yeah, right. The Wait, other day. Shark Club. Yeah, they had like a night where you had to be. You didn't have, it was like eighteen or. It was younger. Sunday night. It was so creepy because you could be like 16 or 20. And I know it's like only four years, but so it just seemed like wrong. So I was like 12, 13 going there? Yeah. <laughs> She's like, I got my my fake ID. It's the Burton Ernie one. Yeah. <laughs> Put on my nicest ring pop and went in trying to find yeah, a suitor. Yeah. yeah, they always want what they can't have. I went to free on the St. Kevin's dance. Out, out, outside with uh, doing fun dip lines in the car. Oh, yeah. Did you ever go to a St. Kevin's dance? That's what scooters? gave me the diabetes. Yeah. Oh, okay. Somebody say scooters. Yeah. Thank you. Kim Shear said Kim. Appreciate you. I don't feel so old now. Danny's Corner Tavern Lar. Uh, Kevin yeah, wants to know. That's yeah. my neck of the woods. That's Lansdale. Yeah. So we used to, I used to live in Lansdale. Oh, I have a tattoo to my arm. <laughs> yes, it's Jules, you had to sign in. It's right above a heart that says nachos. You sure do. <laughs> I do. Yeah. I still live in Lansdale. Okay. Why did you live in Lansdale? I lived with my husband and my mother-in-law before we got married, and Fancy. then we moved out. Yeah. And you actually went to the Danny's Corner Tavern? We did. We walked down there. And then we got some Doc Sally the on the way out. And I forget the lady's name. Mm, it's been a while since I've been there. there. I don't know. I haven't been there in a while. Yeah. We would go to Doc's all the time. Of course. It's the, one of the, it's the best cheesesteak in North Delco. Best cheesesteak around here, I think. Uh, I will be Where? Uh, Doc's? Doc's. Yeah. Doc's is up Sunday. there. I, ha I still lean... Mike and M is a Mike little bit more. Yeah, but that's a sale. But I do. I docs is the one that. Yeah. You never had Mike and Emma's? No. Oh. You're a Polson. You gotta yeah. go. Can we leave right I, now? I do you think they're still open? Right you, ever, <gasps> you ever Anna's? Yes. <laughs> Not to knock Anna's. I think Mike and Emma's is a little bit better than Anna's. Mike and Emma's. I grew up is, on Anna's. Yeah, yeah. Anna's is same. Fun. Their breakfast so sandwiches nice. were just their. But Mike and Emma's, you gotta try. And if you like, uh, they have like the old Italian uh, tuna, where they use okay. the. Uh, uh, like the olive oil in it, but the, their cheesesteaks are the best around here. So they're, they're the best in the Delco City limits, unless we have a sponsor where I can't say that. <laughs> if anyone's paying us, it, they have the best one. Well, we're sorry. Like we're sorry. Mike we're sorry. We're, we're easily bought. No. Yeah, we're like sitting going, listen, our sponsor is such and such cheesesteaks. What's the second best next to Mike and Emma's? Yeah, is, <laughs> That'll is be that our your, slogan for this. Is Doc's your favorite? You said? Yes, Docs. I like Doc's. Okay. Yeah, they got Finally, someone from Lansdowne on the show. Do you ever have Liberty? That uh, yeah, yeah, I've had Liberty right next uh, next to the RS Club. Yeah. I love Liberty. Oh, I heard they're good too. They're really but good. We never really had them. good. Really, really good. Is that the one I got shot at when I was trying to get a cheesesteak? <laughs> well, why? Because it's they're, Chester out. That's so offensive. But yes, there's a lot of shootings there. They're sort of like, Sort of like the consistency of Anna's, but like not Anna's is real, real finely chopped. I feel kind of like Jim Steaks. Jim Steaks is good too. The one in Springfield. 
I think I think Spaz is hungry. I am hungry. He's just like, you know, there's another good cheesesteak. These seven other places. We're talking max. <laughs> we're talking about max and models. Yeah, and I'm thinking about cheesesteaks. Yeah, yeah, so. He's like, <laughs> he's like, you could leave, Laura. We're just going to talk about cheesesteaks for the next hour. Do you have a subscription to Maxim? No. I yes. think you should. Yes. Just so they have your name like in there. Yeah. Like, Laura, you yeah. have to say yes. Do you think it? Would... I think it would help. Okay. Because they might like run numbers and be like, well, this one's actually like giving us money to make a subscription. It's a thing. Maybe they won't pick your favorite. Wait, who? What, <laughs> what my the the goth chick with the gun? Yeah. Oh, she, she has a subscription. I, subscription. I already reached out to her on Instagram. Oh. Even, you know, Lord, no, I'm kidding. That's a sneak. Lord Andrew even agrees with us. Mike and Emma is definitely the best cheese sticker. Who is it? Lord Andrew. Lord Andrew. I'm liking Lord Andrew more and more. That's my time. uncle. It is. Mm -hmm. He's good people. Is he a lord or is that his really his he first really name? He really is a lord. I met somebody whose name who's today whose first name was Alpha. So wait, is it like he's a lord? Like he owns like land in Scotland or something? So shit? friends of his bought him land in England. Oh, uh, the thing where you like spend money to buy. Yeah. Is it like a, uh, a, 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 a twelve-inch by twelve-inch <laughs> piece of grass or something? I'm not sure yeah. how big it is, yeah. but. <laughs> Sorry, Lord. Lord <laughs> Andrew, Lordy, Lord, Lord. I love it. Yeah, I remember those commercials. They run them on like Fox all the time. Mm -hmm. They used to run one on uh, Sirius XM all the time. They're like, oh, do you want to be a lord? Like, buy this one plot of, like, whatever, and we'll send you a piece of paper. Mm. Like adopting a star. Adopting a star, yeah. He said it's Scotland. Space it's Commander not, it is Scotland. I was oh, right. okay. I was right. I thought it was I almost, I almost did Scotland. it, too. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, so since, since you're hanging out for another few with us, right? You're not running out the door? No. Good, all right. Holbrook loosened the chains for you. You're all right over there? The radiator. Oh, no. is He's the, the radiator. girl with the gun. I yeah. know. It's the goth. So. The goth girl. <laughs> he, keeps, <laughs> he keeps bringing up the gun just so she's like, don't move. You saw her, right, though? I don't I know. Saw her. I yeah, it's like talking stands about. out. It's just like you. And then boudoir, but like terrible boudoir pictures. And then it's just like <laughs> the, the chick wearing like literally like a fucking like parka. And then it's just like generic. generic I feel like generic. I have to bring and this then picture up. Goth so I... that is looking unhinged with a gun. I'm like interested. I, I will. Why oh, would... and then the chick who lived everywhere, but she's in a cornfield for no reason. <laughs> What? Yeah, I don't think and, I saw and her. And it's so filtered, like it's like real, but it's like super heavily filtered, but like, like dark and all that shit. It, it looks like it's a CGI thing. I was like, she looks. It's so not real. Like this isn't a. She was CGI. Thing. She's like, I grew up here. I grew up there. I lived there. I lived there. I'm like, you're in a fucking field. Explain the field. <laughs> Tell me about the field. Children of the corn. Yeah. Maybe she liked that that area to take a picture. She all the places she listed. I don't feel had corn. Have you ever run through a cornfield backwards? <laughs> Fun fact about a cornfield recently. I was at a wedding out in fucking like Lancaster. This date's still there, by the yeah, way. Yeah, oh my God. And I pulled, dude, th there's a whole long story about the Amish and all that shit. But I had to pull over to get chained. It's called history. Near a cornfield. And like someone was shooting a gun. It, it ends up they were on like a turkey hunt nearby. But I thought they were like coming in from me or some shit. So I tried to run it into the cornfield, <laughs> which is not like the cartoons, dude. It is like a brick wall and you just yeah. fall and like leave. <laughs> And I didn't have pants on because I was changing into a suit. Yeah. And uh, dude, it was <laughs> what the fuck you were you doing? Yeah, I was like, I'm gonna hide in the field. I'm gonna hide in the corn. And I was like, what was the end game? And I was like, oh cool, I can't even get in there. Nobody can see me. They'll never the find me in the corn. Yeah, Holbrook behind a corn stalk. That'll really get him. It looked like it's like I fell on like a half broken trampoline of just like fucking corn. I was like, what the fuck? It's like the people under the stairs meets the children of the corn. Holbrook making crop circles and shit. Yeah. <laughs> I thought I felt bad because I probably damaged a couple like dozen dollars of corn. I don't know. I don't know. A couple of dollars. <laughs> There's couple like years. three people who won't get popcorn. This yeah. Week. I damaged, let's say, 15 stalks. I assume that's not that much, right? <laughs> like they were broken corn. I, think, I should yeah, just right. take that corn, right? Like I should have thrown them apart. Should have. It would have been the responsible thing to do. <laughs> Some hardy corn. They were over six feet tall. Mm -hmm. oh, geez. Who thought this would have turned into a corn conversation? <laughs> well, well, getting back, we're voting. We're going to vote, vote, vote the shit out of this contest for you. Yes, please. Yes. Thank you. And it's basically, all right, was it Friday? Share. Keep sharing. Fridays. Have your Fr friends share. Every Friday it goes off. Is that what you said? No, it's, it's, it's Thursday. Every Thursday. So Thursday's off. ending. And then the next one ends on the 30th. Yes. And then it goes to, I don't know, July, it, it, probably like 10th, July 7th. August, like e August 18th. So there's. Up to top five, July seventh ends the fourteenth. So are you can then there's different finales. Oh, are you continuously yes. battling the same people in your group? No. Oh, okay. It will be maybe the first top fifteen will go to the next round. Okay. And I'm gonna battle them. And so the group's gonna get smaller and smaller. But it's the same people in your group. Yes. So you will continuously Until... be against the goth with the gun. It's like the Hunger Games. If she huh? makes it. True that. It's like the Hunger Games. Okay. 
right? I would think. Yeah, I mean, kind of. I believe yeah. Laura's exact words, them bitches ain't nothing. I believe those were exact <laughs> so the, words. The 50 She's like, I'm Katniss, go bitches. 20. <laughs> yes. And it's the top 20 that you're dealing with. And then that, those top 20 will get trimmed down to the top 15. Yes. Which is actually only eliminating five people. They, they know how to get their money. Five, 10, 15. Max going to keep going. going. Yeah. Max knows yeah. what they're doing with this. It's just because the one, like, yeah, that's actually good to make a rival. There's a wild card round now. Oh, so people let's who make that. second place in the finales can go to the wild card round and try to win first place. Then they go to the, the finale. Losers bracket situation. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, no, so the loser <laughs> does go to Cincinnati, Ohio for their photo shoot. I mean, guys. <laughs> Who's the teacher from Cincinnati? Yeah. The second place winner goes to Crumlin for yeah. their photo shoot. <laughs> It's actually in Folsom. It's right around the corner from her house. If yeah. for some reason you don't win, it's actually your husband set up this whole website of just you like posing the most Delco shit possible. If what? If you for some reason don't win, can we do a Delco live calendar and you just like pose for Delco related shit? Sure. Okay. And and the can proceeds you wear a can go to shirt? whoever you're whoever you're trying to win this twenty five k for. Yeah. Say it again. And the proceeds can go to whoever that twenty five k is. True. That would be amazing. Yeah. That yeah. would be amazing. We could do shit. We know peeps. Hey, you can't do shit. We would really appreciate <laughs> you can't that. Do shit. Dude, we could totally do that. That would actually make sense because it's just like it would end in August. You would find that out. And then if Thirst comes out in December, you know, or whatever, like it's 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 December. Like they get to be on this thing and be like, Yeah, we got a calendar coming out for the next fucking year, which is when you release them in December. It's like, a, yeah. this one's for better. This one's for better reasons. It's a much better idea because uh, uh, something that keeps floating around is like us doing a calendar. Okay. Like fat guy calendar. And you've seen how <laughs> nope. attractive we are in the pictures that we, that we right. Nobody so wants yeah. to. Nobody wants that. And uh, we probably raise like you know we probably want to owe money. I would owe money. Yeah. 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 If you want us to owe money, Holbrook's your man. <laughs> That's I'm pretty good at it. Uh, so we do have some Tinder posts you want to go through here, mainly Lara's. Lars Tinder posts. So we're gonna go through them here. Okay. <laughs> we ever on Tinder? No. Yeah, I was gonna say you said you've been married for seven years. That's like kind of when Tinder came out. No. What would your Tinder profile say? Oh God, I don't even know. It's yeah. a tough one. I was gonna actually tell people like come, come on that. I'm like write your write your most ridiculous. Tinder I'm not profile. sure. Are they like are they are they most fil mostly filthy? Uh, it depends. Literally, it's just up to your personality. You'll see. Yeah. Fourteen that are somewhere cringeworthy. Some are okay. fucking brilliant. I can't wait. These are all real. These are all real ones I, I pulled today. Perfect date. How'd you do well in Met Foreman? <laughs> what? That would be my Tinder profile. Um, <laughs> all right, Allie to fudge you the way I'll kick out of the trash one time. So that's why. <laughs> this week. Do you remember one time? One time this week. Fudge you the whale Carvel. Carvel is shaped like a whale. They had, they had the cookie puss, and then they had... <laughs> They, they that one, I, don't, I feel like the person who's like marketing these. Did he just these, make that up? No, 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 no this is real. Really? I just feel like the person cookie. who was like setting up marketing like wanted cake. to see how far they can go with it. It was a cookie. It was an octopus made out of cookie, <laughs> cookie puss. And then there was Fudgy the whale, which is a brown whale that was chocolate. And Al ate most of a Fudgy the whale out of a trash can. They, they tell the story in so his wrong. Thirties. So, no, 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 no. <laughs> I was I was twenty nine. Guy. Yes, yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> About an hour before you walked in, Laura. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the trash can's right there. Yeah. Thankfully, I screamed. Is that why you buy the dumpster? What's up? Is that why you buy the that's dumpster? That's right. Yeah. That's yes. usually where I do most of my work. Yes. <laughs> it reminds me of Holbrook. That's called my house. <laughs> <laughs> that's my home for the short period of time. Have you and, seen the market recently? And LT, since we met you, and since we just met you, we'll save the Choco Taco story for another uh, that's time. <laughs> we, we just call that on. Say we'll save it for another time. Yes. Uh, so here is some of Holbrook's favorite Tinder posts. Yeah. Uh, this is Joy27. She's from six miles away. Her literal post. This is not made up. These are not fucking. These, these are real. Her fucking profile is, am I on the left or the right? Is it a risk you're willing to take? <laughs> oh, that's actually here's the funny part is like you bold. could I that's, love it. that is bold. No, but the best part about it is depending on how you look in that picture, it could be left or right either way. Oh, okay. So okay. she could get you on that one. That's true. That's she, true. She might be a uh, you know, a legal beagle. If this was Delco, where would this picture be taken? Marty McGee's. That's Whoa. a pretty it's a pretty good one. 
pretty good one. I, I mean, I gotta go to the Ridley House. <laughs> no, like, where's the hell the is one? she wearing? What's that? Oh, it's that's a guy in front of her. I'm looking at that guy's shoulder underneath that cup. Oh, never mind. Uh, R&S that's Club. a girl. The guy, there's a guy in front. I thought. Yeah, but was... she's got a bun. That's a girl, dude. That's a oh, girl. that's a girl. Yeah, cool. I can't see the without one, my glasses. The one on the left looks a lot like Prophet in a Viking helmet. Oh right. yeah. Okay, I changed my mind. This would be Prophet's basement. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she holding a bottle of chocolate syrup. That's why I can't figure <laughs> it out. I think it's a Michelob uh, Ultra. Oh, uh, uh, looks like a squeeze bottle of chocolate it's syrup. Ultra light, so it's ultra light. She's trying. She's ultra trying. light. It's tell. ultra light chocolate syrup. So you were you looking at these or did you pull these offline? So these weren't like you weren't looking through your Tinder profile and pulled these. I don't know if he's. An They're angel. saved in his photos. Yeah. yeah. Is, tin, is Tinder? We're actually just access. Tinder's a now. swipe right, swipe left thing. Yes. Uh, this is Kath. She's 23 years young. Hi, Kath. I would like to cover you in peanut butter and see how much I I could lick. Ah, sorry. I would like to cover you in peanut butter and see how much I could lick off before my peanut butter allergy killed me. <laughs> That's pretty good. It's bold. It's bold, it's cotton. Bold, move. It's bold cotton. Bold She's now, interesting. Now she seems cute. Why is she on this fucking thing, huh? Because yeah. not every <laughs> cute person can find someone. And not she's every searching cute... for her death. I mean, <laughs> it's one way to go. I don't. Uh, yeah. not, also, every, not every cute person's normal. I just want to throw that out also, there. Where, where in America is it? Where you're just like, yeah, or how desperate are you to be like, I need to hook up 61 miles away. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna go down to fuck you. No, because he saw this chick and he's like, "All right, I got, all right, let me let me see this." <laughs> Andrew, 27. <laughs> it's him and two cows, and uh, he uh, two reasons to date me: one, because you'd be the good-looking one, and two, please. <laughs> now, I I, I would feel take... like that's your profile, Holbrook. <laughs> I love it. I would take this picture and put it with the other caption. All right, I could be the one on the left or the right. Yeah. But, you know, are you willing to take that? Yeah, some people would rather have the left than the right. A new new take the right. I know that. <laughs> it looks it looks a lot like the Fat Cow Jerky promo. Oh, yeah. utterly I think this will be the new Fat Cow Jerky promo. <laughs> Emma, 29 years old, less than a kilometer away. I tried to crop out the dramatic Asian lady, but I couldn't. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty dramatic. Um <laughs> She gets swipe left, right? Is that when you don't like it? I, I swipe right on her. Swipe left just because she's using kilometers. Who uses kilometers? It might be from Europe or some shit. Oh. Uh, as a, as a, can you go back to that one? Oh, hey. As a hairstylist, how do you feel about her bangs? I like her bangs. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. She bangs. She bangs. <laughs> she bangs. I wrote to William Hung today. <laughs> Zach, 30, goes to Oregon State, 22 miles away. I got a B plus in human sexuality in college. So let's just say I know my way around uh, checks poorly scribbled notes. Clibberous. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Zach. I like you, Zach. All and right. he's dreamy. Yeah, he's absolutely a well, stud. From yeah. the neck down. Would you slide left or right on this if you were single? Which one's no? On Zach? Yeah. Just Which say one? no. Would you swipe yes or, or no? No. You say no. He's a good looking dude. Really? And he's got a sense of humor. Where's his head? Well, but I assume he has one. With a bun like that, who needs that a, is a <laughs> That is kind of like a... That could be like a catfish. It could. Mm. Good for him, because he got my clibris all wet. Clibris. <laughs> <laughs> I good. love that one. It's that pretty, one would have been my favorite. pretty good. Laura, 21 uh, years old, 10 miles away. Damn, boy, you must be my GPA, because I know I could do better. I'm just too lazy to actually try. <laughs> Uh, I like her. Uh, great. <laughs> she looks like a movie star. I'm trying to figure out who it is. Would you swipe? Look, would I, you swipe yes or no, Al? Oh, personality, and she's not bad looking. Yeah, yeah. I swipe yes. I don't understand. Yeah, these are all cute people. They're good looking. Listen, people. they could be fake too. You know that, right? This well, I, I don't really know. For gym, so we don't know. I mean, you you make yourself look the best you possibly can. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Hol Holbrook puts on his finest, least dirtiest shirt. Yeah. Wrinkles show the personality of the shirt. Okay. Sydney with two E's and not a Y. 25, 17 miles away. I like romantic dinners, long walks on the beach, and penetration. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I see the, a girl with the name Sydney, I think of Scream. Okay. Me too. Yeah. yeah. That's my favorite movie. I love, Ever. I love that movie. Okay. Like best, one of my favorites. Did you see the new one? I did. Did you like it? I did. It was uh, it was a little. Was different. it just like one of those homage movies where it's just like, all right? You didn't see it? No, I did not see you it. You gotta watch it. I have it on. What's it on? Uh, Peacock or whatever. I have to watch. I haven't watched it yet. 
it. Yeah, definitely watch it. I went to see it's the different. new. I saw the new Jurassic Park. It was okay. So I want to know. Where are you taking that. Sydney for uh, for a date around here, Al? What local establishment? Uh, pound Pound, apparently, because she's all about penetration. <laughs> Mickey Vernon Field. At least it wasn't the first <laughs> thing she said. <laughs> At least it wasn't the first thing she said. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, if I can find a place that's sandy, we can take a long walk and I can bang her. I mean, that's uh, Darby yes, Crick. Darby Crick, I got a soul. <laughs> Hey, Sydney, looks like we're going to Essington. <laughs> we're going to Main Street Pizza and then walk down the Darby Creek and then Pound Town. <laughs> yeah, all right. Do you know what? Helen, yeah, Natalie Portman. I think that was a picture of Natalie Portman. What, the last what? one? Really? Yeah, yeah. I don't I agree with that. I, I think it's like a young Natalie Portman. Who? The one jumping out of the pool? No, this one. <laughs> That looks like Natalie Portman. I don't, yeah, a little I don't. bit. No, it's not oh, a little bit. That is what? Natalie Portman. Yeah, yeah, in the eyes. Okay. Maybe they faced. It they re so blurred. Like maybe they re faced Natalie looks... Portman. You're like, not gonna want to hear what I said. It looks like it, Al in my own head. Who? She kind of looks like Adele. All right. Well, guess I'm going to shoot her. Yeah, <laughs> not a fan. Nah, that bitch can eat a dick. Oh, oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ! Settle down. You're gonna Kim, get Kim, 22 years old. The name's Kim. Big heart, bigger cock. <laughs> Oh, Wait, oh, is that what she's looking for? Oh, or is that... No, I think that's her. I think she may be a possible lady wow. boy. A lady boy. <laughs> wow. I think she may be just an open lady boy looking for love. Big heart. Big heart, bigger cock. <laughs> I mean, at least she's not false advertising. No, she's... you know. So if you sign up for swiping right on this, you you chose. I think we, it could be false advertising. It's not that big of a cock, or her heart is not that big. Thank you. Well, she has like a tiny heart, like a like a like a malfunction or like a genetic disorder. Like how she And that makes dick. her dick look bigger. It only has to be a little bigger for her not to be falsely, falsely lying to us. Thank you, Daddy. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Where are you taking Kim for on a date, Al? Uh, uh, the lube store? Because I don't think it's as big as she's saying is. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not going to take that to the good night. Are you going to pull two-way petting zoo with her? She pets you, you pet her back? <laughs> no, no, man. Animal Providence Shelter. This is Nyak. <laughs> Nyak. Nyak. She's 9,275 miles away. About Nyak? I love a long walk on the beach and small dicks. Right. So don't Stop hook it. girl with Kim. Don't hook girl with Kim. Stop it. That's totally fake. <laughs> no, there's actually a thing, apparently. Like, there's like websites for girls who like only want to date guys who have less than average size penises. I don't know. Don't ask me. Just, it's a thing. Does your wife know you looked into that? Oh, uh, you! I swear to God, for all the research we do he for the show, on when he found all these pictures, I have, I have literally went to my wife. If you want to leave me, look at my search history, and I'm not talking about all the porn because I delete that. I'm talking about anything else because of all the shit we've looked up for this show. There'd be times like I'll, I'll look it up, uh, and I'm like, Jesus, this is my it's, it's this real. is my Google. Yeah. So we're looking up stuff on my Google. Yeah. So I'm screwed. It's... I can't type in a name without it saying, "Do you mean nude?" <laughs> like you'd be like, "When's George Washington's birthday?" And be like, "Do you mean George Washington nude?" A little bit. Yeah, let's see what's going on with that. It's, it's, or, it's that, or like you put somebody's name in, and then it says "wife" next to it. Yeah. Like I always want to see what their wife looks like. The wag. Like, the something with me. Girlfriend. It's real. I for a while I only dated women with small vaginas, so <laughs> it's it's a real thing. Does it make the twigs and berries look bigger? <laughs> it's a real fetish. <laughs> a real fetish. Well, I mean, yeah, it's you know, as an as, is that a deal breaker for most girls. Sometimes it's all it's all. What's meat. that? Laura, is it a deal breaker for most girls? Small penises. Is this? Um, I don't know. Everybody has a different preference. <laughs> How, do you know I mean, any? Not small? you, but do you know any of your friends or anything? Like, I only like it small. Al's asking no. if your friends are size queens. No, I, you don't. You don't have a single friend that's into small dicks. No, I don't think so. Go big or go home is like pretty much all you and your friends. What a waste yes. of an interview! Yeah. <laughs> Get out! <Yeah. laughs> this is all meant for nothing. Can I take my votes back? Yeah. <laughs> Sit up over the goth of the gun. <laughs> this is Tyler. Have you ever gone shopping for new jeans? Shopped all morning and started to get hungry. Slash frustrated because you can't find a pair that fit just quite right. You decide to get some lunch and try a couple of other stores on the other side of town. You're just about to quit when you remember that lucky store. So you go search for another hour when boom, there they are. The perfect pair. The kind that you actually call your mother to talk about them. Yeah, I'm those jeans of your romantic life. 
I don't know if I find this humorous or I'm annoyed that I had to read that if I'm a girl. I like totally gave up. Yeah. yeah. I... Did you get to like the second or third sentence? You're like, I'm scrolling left. I yeah. also don't know which one it is. Yeah. Yeah. And why are you taking, if you're on a dating app or just trying to bang or whatever, why are you with two, two of your guy friends? Like, and also, what... they look essentially the same. They are just three white dudes. It's very weird. They're just three white dudes being white lame. at Christmas, I assume. Yeah. Wearing their lame Christmas sweaters. Yeah. God. Trevor is me, Tyler. Yeah, Tyler and Trevor. I'm gonna go talk to some minorities later. Me and Gun Goth wouldn't even like go to that party. It looks terrible. Carol with a K. Caroli. Caroli. Yeah. You know you want to suck a skittle out of my ass. Okay, <laughs> sold. Wow. Hold on, hold on. Sold. See now, the jeans guy has to learn from Caroli. Yeah, because <laughs> I'm interested. I'm just saying, yeah. like. I would, th- I'm, I'm, I'm just assuming this. You can tell me I'm wrong. I, I'd go 30 miles to find out what's going on. With yeah, that. like, <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, he's like, if a, if, a guy, if the guy with the jeans, instead of saying this whole soliloquy of bullshit about jeans, he said, I'm going to slap you in the face with a Snickers bar. You'd be like, oh, you know that's how you do it. I kind of want to know. Get to the yeah. point. Yeah. Like a skill out of my ass. <laughs> I wouldn't, like, I would swipe right and then instantly just go, sold. Like, I need to meet you. Yeah, but... I wonder, Not even a sexual way. I'd have I'm to find out if she also on. did M&M's as well. Yeah, I don't know if I would want to suck anything chocolate out of somebody's I don't... I haven't had a... Rule of thumb, thumb, it's never chocolate out the ass. It's just, you can't do that. You, mm. There is a Russian roulette you don't want to play. But Skittles are... Okay. No, any, yeah, Skittles, because you bite into a Skittle, you know it's a Skittle. <laughs> just saying. <laughs> Sounds like you had an intimate... I'm just saying, all right, man? <laughs> I don't... Like, I, I, who hurt you, dude? My therapist. <laughs> Who, is hurt you? Bring <laughs> Who hurt you? Alter boy. <laughs> Allison, 23, 77 miles away. Our relationship should be like a Nintendo 64. A Nintendo 64. Classic. Fun to spend hours with. And every issue easily fixed by blowing on it and then shoving it back in. Oh. Five foot nine. <laughs> you know wow. what? Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. Good for you, Allison. Well, 23, n- Nintendo 64. Nintendo 64 was probably... I feel like it's more Nintendo when you blow on it. I don't think you blow on Nintendo well, 64. Let's talk about this. could be an older one where she set this up in like, well, in like 2014. Oh, uh, no. Okay. Even 23-year-olds like to play on Nintendo 64. It seems a little ageist, but I'm just going to throw that out there. Maybe, yeah. This one's my favorite. One of my favorites. Oh, my God. Terran, you- 20. <laughs> I'm dying to meet you. Oh. When can I see you? Oh, oh no. Stop. <laughs> Darren's friends are mean. <laughs> That's Literally, it says I'm dying to meet you. And this says, when can, if this is, you're only listening to the audio, it's I see you. So, like, the intensive, the intensive carry. When them? can I see you? I see you. And he's fucking literally on his That's deathbed. Like, so bad. <laughs> That's so terrible. <laughs> Lauren, wow. 21. Her job is an arms dealer. I just noticed that. If anyone listens to only the podcast, she only has one arm. She's cute, but she only has one arm. Hands down, best catch on Tinder. Face, 10 out of 10. Body, 9 out of 10. Personality, 20 out of 10. Arms, 1 out of 2. <laughs> <laughs> I just noticed she's listed shop as arms dealer. That's, oh, that's amazing. That, that's, you struck gold. You struck gold, yeah. Lauren. Laura, awesome. Laura, would you do I like Lauren. Uh, Laura, how, how do you feel about, like, if you found, like, the perfect guy in your life and he was missing a foot or something? <laughs> like, that was a question because the doctor he's, yeah. told the diabetes is getting a little out of yeah, control. Yeah, I just want to know. I just want to know how women feel about, like, one less foot. If he was missing a foot? Or an arm or anything. You would I your, stay? If you, all right, if you had to choose, a dis, if you had to choose one limb to take away from your husband, what would it be? Hmm. <laughs> If he really pissed you off, you're like, oh, I'm going to take a limb away from him. Maybe a toe. Just a toe? Yeah. What if I was really bad? You need to go full foot or hand or something more. I feel like you would just get divorced before you start taking appendages right. out. I don't know. Like, you're, you might a different kind of breed. You never something. pissed me off before when we were married, so I'm just going to throw it out there. And that's about it. So. <laughs> Why? Do you think about what appendages you <laughs> cut know. off of your wife? <laughs> No. No, you just I'm just saying the way you no. asked her, it was Why very we... you were very happy. You're like, hey. <laughs> so like what I do you want to chop off? I, I I would never do that to her. Bitch, dinner better be ready. Uh <laughs> she even raises when I take a shin. <laughs> well, you go you go for like something in the middle, huh? Yeah. You're like, yeah, I'm gonna really screw you. 
Uh, so, like we said, As you need my sign up and sign, <laughs> sign up and vote for Laura Tuck. Hell yeah. Yes, please. Let's get LT that and 25 If you haven't K. seen him on the, uh, I'll throw him up here real quick. If you haven't seen her, her shots here that you would see on. Well, that one you clearly did take yourself. Your shots, phone's literally shots, in your hands. Shots, 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 shots. <laughs> that one you probably also took. Al, <laughs> go slower. Oh, you want to go slower, Al? <laughs> slower. You want to talk dirty slower. while I'm doing it, did too? You, <laughs> did you take that one to work? Yes, I did. I was going to say that has to be work. You buy a product, you get a chance to spin the wheel. What? Oh, and the wheel is like free products? You get a percentage off. Oh, what's the most percentage of off? You could do the BOGO. Oh, buy one, get one. BOGO off. gets me every time. Oh, look at this. Where's that at? That's out front of my house. Oh, yeah? In that Folsom? was on my birthday. When's your birthday? October 15th. Oh, my God. That's you're almost head. a Scorpio. I know. I'm a Libra. We're good peeps. Yeah, no, I'm a Scorpio. Did it all We're change? Because I think mine terrible changed. Terrible Did they just change all that shit? They tried to do that. And they tried. Like, we don't and now it's back. It. Yeah. It's I back to so. normal. Because yeah. I was a Capricorn, and then it moved, and whatever it was. Because I'm not a fucking Virgo. Let's start with that. Like, <laughs> yeah. And this so, is the picture on the main the main boat. Yes. Yes. Is that in your vehicle? Yes, it is. The driver's seat? Yes. Where were you when you took that? I was out front of my house. Okay. Okay. Oh, all right. That was in St. Martin. St. Martin. Same St. Martin. Rob and Charlene at (laughs) Putt-Putt. That was at Putt-Putt? No. (laughs) Putt-Putt is so much better. Rob and Charlene came. We went with them to St. Martin. Oh, cool. Oh, Putt-Putt must be good to them. That's also at St. Martin. Yes. Is that the one where the plane like? They're my right very good the... friends. Yes, that's that piece. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. That's uh, uh, right next to Aruba. Is that Aruba in there? Aruba. I it's love one of the Aruba. Islands, right? I think that's down You've been there. to Aruba? Yes, three oh, you've been, times. You've been to all the fancy places down there. Nice. I love Aruba. That's, that's my up. favorite. Aruba. Mm-hmm. Nicole Gaffney says a skittle. A skittle. There you go. Get it? Uh, a good old skittle. Oh no, Al. There's an ongoing what color? Joke about that. What color skittle? That was what I was gonna ask. <laughs> That's also in my car. <laughs> or somebody's car. She may have just sat in somebody's random car and took a picture. That's Is that the, also a car? That's the backseat of my sister's car. Oh. This Chrissy Ann? No. Oh, younger you're, sister, Becky. You're dressed up. Were you going to Becky. Outback or possibly some sort of Bertucci's? It must have been You called me. I was going to a wedding. Oh, all right. All right. <laughs> well, Were you in the wedding? No. Okay. Did you like the people, or at least one of the two people, getting married? I like both of them. I ask questions Absolutely. like that because I could say about fifty percent of the weddings I went to, I didn't like either the bride and/or groom. <laughs> no, I like both of them. Fair enough. Are they going to make it? Marissa's like family. Okay. Do you sit yeah. there and go like, mm, I give it five years? No. All right, I do. I don't think I would go. I oh no, I just don't. I give right. them a toaster. If you don't, if I don't think it's going to go at least five years, it's like a toaster or a small appliance. A toaster of death. Yep. It's pretty much can opener. I feel like if I like if I got married and like I'm opening up presents and stuff and there's a toaster, I'm like these people don't think we we either belong together or it's not going to last. And Is that St. Martin's? That's Wildwood. Of oh, I can tell. I can tell. I can tell <laughs> yeah, by about the French guy sitting behind you, awkwardly staring at you. No, you get that in Wildwood, right? Is yeah. that what you're saying? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh yeah. There's a lot of like French Canadians. Yeah, there's a Martin. lot of Quebecers. A lot of Quebecers. Quebecians. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, it's a pretty rad hat. In the, in the last know. but not yeah. least. Uh, oh, uh, my God. So hot. So oh sexy. This guy. Just loves the cuddle. Yeah. <laughs> you can't help but not to. <laughs> yeah. Yo, Jeff is watching. <laughs> we got like six posters. Uh, <laughs> Jeff, five of them were from me. <laughs> oh, Jeff, I need one of my toaster quick. <laughs> So uh, for those who uh, are normally watching the show, uh, Carrie's not here today because as of last week, her and Jeff have officially tied the knot. Congratulations. So congratulations. Congratulations, yeah, Carrie, congratulations to you knuckleheads. I was originally their minister, but then they... They, they found out, yeah, not a good idea. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we'll just leave it at that. Yeah. Carrie, Carrie walking like she's been on a horse horseback riding trip or what? Oh, no, <laughs> Carrie's mom is watching, by the way. I, uh, I'm just throwing that out there. I think I'm going to make a post Jeff. of me and her at the prom, and then her and Jeff all happy at the wedding and be like, I guess it's an upgrade. I guess it's okay. I yeah. guess it's an upgrade. <laughs> <laughs> so, I didn't have you all at this fucking wedding. So if you guys are looking for things to do, July 9th, don't forget, uh, a lot of palooza. Every time I hear that word, I think of the, gr- the, the girl from Austin Powers, a lot of vagina. But a lot of palooza. 
is going to be there July is a lot of vagina these events by the way yeah. if you're trying to hook up with a chick like it's actually a fucking cool place. you hear that laura if you're trying to hook up with a chick you get a lot of palooza i'll be right there she'll be there <laughs> this is a, a new news newspaper is it new news uh so pint for pint whiskey and wine ziggy and the moon dogs walt left is it left p walt lefty walt Silver lefty. Tide. uh we'll be there and there's Oh, uh, the Sons of Delco, too, right? Did I read that right? Lisa. Yeah, Lisa. Yeah, they're cool. Yeah, so they'll be there. Uh, and don't forget, guys, we'll be putting this up on our social media and website shortly. The Delco Masters returns. The fourth annual, not the first one, where you, know, you go out and you buy yourself a nice little putt-putt yeah. and start your own and call it yeah. you know, something else. No. The Delco Masters, fourth annual, four fucking yeah. years. You didn't create it this year, 6ABC. You did <laughs> Yeah. How can you create the seventh annual this year? Yeah, that's that's the best part, yeah. Fight me. <laughs> LT knows Bob Kelly. We yeah. were on it. Pug I don't pug. know Bob Kelly. You know people who know Bob Kelly. Yeah. I went to a chat with Bob Kelly. <laughs> I know we're not supposed to talk about it. It was definitely him. He was definitely Bob Kelly. We'll be there I'm with kidding. the meat. That, that's not true. Don't sue me for live. We'll be there with the meat. Uh, fact out jerky. We need some. Uh, we need some uh, prize prizes for the prize basket. So yeah, hit us up. Um, a staple, a Delco staple putt putt is a Delco staple. Spent many of summers hanging out in that right. open 364 days a year. What day are they closed, Al? Christmas, they're closed on Christmas. And how long have they been around? 51 years. Hell yeah. And real quick, I want to um just kind of recap something here. Uh, Delco Day 7, huge success, guys. I uh, heard of it. Uh, I want to thank everybody. Like, we had a lot of bands come out, uh, and then Pine for Pine also I was know there. Them. Uh, but now we had, uh, was I was going to join on the news. We had 15 of the, we had 14 of the 15 people, uh, play who were signed up to play. <laughs> no, Josh played just 72 hours later. Yeah. He was part of Delco Day 7.5. <laughs> Don't cover Tom Day Curtis remainder. Has been, go, do it again. Go back. Go back. Uh, I can't. It's kind of on its own oh, little right, rotation fine. right now. Buzzkill absolutely slayed it. Buzzkill's awesome. Yeah. They did a great yeah, job. Yeah. Um, Bridget, spectacular. Wait, who did you Jeremy want me to go back to? Voice of an Angel. Jeremy's awesome. Who did you want me to go back to? I was going to say, Nick McGrath. Prophet was there. Yeah. Yeah. Nick McGrath, spectacular. He'll be at the uh, Dolan's Lot of Palooza. Yeah. And I also want a big big old thank you. Oh, Vixen Vixen 77. 77. Unbelievable. Listen, absolutely. Yeah, let's talk about them for a quick second. And the pools. (laughs) Pools. Pools are awesome. Yeah. Vixen 77 was fucking awesome. I'm bummed I did not get a chance to really see them. Oh, my God. They shredded. They did an amazing job. Great energy. And here's some of the great sponsors who make Delco Day possible. So I want to throw more love out there to Three Brothers Pile, um, Coaches Bar and Grill right here in Essington, which is down the street in Essington, Wolf Superior Sandwiches, Pro Tree Services, Fat Cow Jerky, and, of course, Arnie's Army. So you don't have to have a business. If you just want to show some love for somebody, Arnie's Army showed you how to do it. Uh, and don't forget our awesome sponsors here at – the Cherry Firm at CherryInjuryLaw.com. David R. Cherry, 610-565-0300. For all your workers' comp, motor vehicle, personal injury, and criminal law needs. And like I said earlier, Fat Cal Jerky, utterly perfect jerky. Check them out at FatCalJerky.com. Find them on Facebook, Instagram, some great flavors, just a few up here. Jalapeno garlic, honey habanero. Uh, the pickle is one of my favorite and my probably my most favorite right now, the breakfast maple. Pretty big. The one that they just re-released for Delco Day, the original. The original spicy. Article. Yeah, unbelievable. Absolutely. Already ate four bags of it. Four. I hawked around at the end of the night and I ate up all his like little samples, like his little yeah. beef jerky samples. I was like, hey, ah, ah. I was like, I was like a turkey. <laughs> turkey like chewing you away. <laughs> yeah. <Stop> nah. <laughs> oh shitty shit. Oh man. Um, and uh, we already uh, we already set for uh, announced next year. I'm going to throw it up June here. June 10th is a Saturday next year. It's a no fucking brainer. Kenny Chesney, do not fucking come through that day. Yeah, he you learned, learned already. You learned your lesson and did it You know, on the 17th or 18th this year. Mm-hmm. Good for you. Good for you. You learn. So it's on the 10th next year. It'll be the sixth year on the books. It'll be the eighth year of fucking going out there. Del Code 861 Ocho. It's coming at you. It's coming at you hard. If you want to be a sponsor, don't miss a chance to be part of it. We could plug you for an entire fucking year. We can work something out. Oh, we're gonna plug you. If your band right. wants to play, don't suck and like be able to draw people and hit us up. If you suck and you don't draw, we're not gonna fucking entertain you. Do it. Yeah, and and, and take take an interview from us too. Uh, we're gonna. I have a feeling Delco Delco Day Eight. We're gonna be able to celebrate 
Miss Laura on the cover of Maxim. Uh, you want to be one of our guest celebrities amazing. that day? You going to do? We pick some pictures. We'll get you a little sash that says Miss Delco. Yeah, absolutely. Miss, Miss Delco Actually, day. I believe somebody was celebrating their bachelorette party at Delco Day. Yeah. Yes. No, that was amazing. I think that might have been. Or was it 21? Was she 21? She had a crown and a sash. I wasn't sure which one uh, it was. There was actually multiple parties at mm -hmm. Delco Day. I, I love the fact that people plan their bachelorette parties and birthdays around Delco Day. I think yeah. it's badass. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. guys, uh, Laura, thank you for putting up with our bullshit shenanigans. Thank you for yeah, having thank me. You vote, so much. vote. Send up yes, the link again. Vote. Yeah. Keep voting. Send up the link. All right, smash it down their the throats. Or, we're gonna yeah. shove it down their throats for the next month or two. I will literally turn this page into just nothing but a next couple fan months. Page. Every day. We got you. <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's posted, pinned up on the uh, Facebook Delco, page. Baby, Delco. Uh, did, you, did you choose Laura Eleven, or is there eleven other Lauras? No, I didn't choose that. Oh, it sounds like yeah. there's 11 other Laura. It's because she's number one, but she's that much of a Laura, number one. They gave her Laura two. 11. Number I one need two. <laughs> number one in our hearts. But uh, yes, hopefully Laura will be the first Delco girl as far as we know. Because we really didn't do the research to find out if there was any other option, one out there. But We're going to go with it. We're going to go with it. We're going to run it. Well, Goth Gun is from Madison, Wisconsin. <laughs> I've already hit her up. <laughs> We're gonna go to a. We're By gonna the way, if we ever start a band, Laura. She's from Lower Child. Laura, if we start a band together, it's gonna be called Goth Gun. Goth Gun. Yeah. <laughs> Me and her are going to a pack. Could you be the lead this fall? If we started a band, what would you do? Sing, guitar, hmm. drummer. What you do? What's your What's your preference? I would dance. You would just. Dance? I can't sing. I, you, can't, I can't. Play it doesn't stop Holbrook. He can't. I'll be sing your background dancer. Yeah. There you okay. go. So wait. There you go. If you if you know if you win this, are you going to like seek out like a career modeling? I would love that. Yeah, I would love that. Hire an agent and like see where it goes. I mean, obviously, like getting on Maxim is like uh, someone should be calling you, right? I guarantee you're gonna get like phone calls yeah. out the ass. If I go that far, when I go that far, there you go. Oh. Like it. And they start calling me. Yes. Okay. Uh, would you quit your uh, your your salon job? I don't think I would quit. What would you it want? Depends you have to. what happens. You'd have to. What would you? But want I would to model? still want to do that. What would you want to model? I'll model everything. Can I have any sandwiches? Any creepers? Absolutely. Any creepers? Fighting a sandwich? Yeah. Any creepers slide oh, into excited. your DM for through they, this? Yeah. Oh, they, tell us. They're, tell us everything. Well, well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can, can we get. <laughs> read on. Read on. Read on. Can read we on. get, like, can we have you back with us? Yes, yeah, she's reading them. Okay. Yes. Just one. The one. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Before you do this, does the husband know about these creepy messages? Yes, I told him. Can I, without even saying, I, we, we're prefacing this without can sending I? races. Are any of them like Indian people that are just like you look good, sex you fun? <laughs> <laughs> like where it's just the language barriers completely fucked up. Um, no. One sent me my own photo. Yes. And said, "Nice to meet you." Wait, they, <laughs> wait, wait, they <laughs> sent you your Dude, own where photo. Where are you? Where? I like C very much. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> I like to talk to you. You like C too. I am Chinese, currently living in San Francisco. May I meet you? Be like, yeah, if you I actually want to like, I actually want to like fulfill this one day. Like I want to like go on a messenger that we can't get hacked into, like just set up in one and just be like, yes. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Asian guy from San Francisco. I, I want to meet you. Yeah. Was he the only uh come to Delco? No. Let's let's hear the other one. No. I thought you guys wanted me to read one. Is there oh, any no, is there no. anything no. Like, let me ask this question? Them. Is there anything that really went over the top that just sticks with you? From people so like makes DMing you feel, me, yeah. yeah. I didn't really read everybody's. Okay. I just saw. So it did your DMs kinda, explode eh. because of this? Yeah. Okay. You're yeah. much better than me. I read all my hate mail. I actually I love it. Actually, it just gets all real excited. Yeah. yeah. No women. Is it I hate got women. My, oh, my, women been hitting on you. Yeah. What my is buddy, is just... it, do you get any hate like mauling degrades women bullshit like that? No, nobody has said anything. No, okay. Yeah. My buddy just sent me a message. He said maybe we'll do it. He did uh, with his girlfriend. Uh, when somebody sends you like a creepy message, have your husband send them a dick pic of his dick. <laughs> yeah. You know, send them back. <laughs> Actually, I have a business that is that I do that. Yeah, I just send dick pics to people. Stunkcock. Stunkcock. Stunk com. Stunk oh com. So you also gosh. feel weird about doing yours. Yeah. All right. Well, I say we compile all these creepers into a nice, manageable, bite-sized segment for one of our shows <laughs> coming up. Yeah. Well, we'll have to, listen. We'll hey, do a follow-up video with you, either on a show or separately or whatever. Okay. And like mid-July, just to see where you're at. Sounds good. And keep us posted. Absolutely. I want you to keep us posted. Let us know what's going on. And even if you, you know, somehow lose, which we doubt, we don't think that's going to happen. I'm not going to lose. Shut your damn mouth. Yeah. You got 20,000 strong here that uh, 
ha- have dealt with us and haven't unfollowed us yet. Yeah, we actually grow somehow. People be with actually like us. Oh I my god! <laughs> and it just I'm just letting you know, like this is just viral marketing. I don't know how you could have to have this happen. When helicopters crash around here or bears end up down here, man, does our sh- does our page get a lot of views? Yeah. So if you can find a bear or a crash a helicopter and everyone's surviving, it's okay. If you can get a bear, the, this, if you get a bear, if you get a bear to, to crash a helicopter, yeah. if a helicopter crashes, yeah. everyone's okay, and a bear fucking attacks the helicopter, <laughs> you're this, winning. This is what you need to do. You need to go to like Staples or some sign store. Get like a sign about Yay Pig that says "Vote for Lar on Maxim," and put the little the link there and find all these like cra- helicopter crash lights. Apparently, we have forty of them around there at any point in time. Bear attacks and just stand there. <laughs> like like when the news are there, still QR code. Behind, Give her a QR code. QR code. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Wild mark technology. Yeah, we're we're good like that. <laughs> we went bear hunting and had forty thousand views on it. So yeah, it happened. I don't know. But uh, by other bears, than that, he means by bears, he means homosexual. Yes, that's what they call yes. me. Apparently, I find out that I was called a bear by a gay man. I did not know what that meant. That's now, means, yeah, because I'm big and hairy, and he thought I was gay and like penis. <laughs> And you like penis every once in a while. Uh, I know. I think I look like a penis. I think that's what it is. The I, last gay person to hit on me said that I was quirky, and I was very. Proud we called of you that. a quirky something directly. Quirky. <laughs> he said. He said it like no one it was. It was at a gay bar. I did not know it was a gay bar. And he's like, "You're you're a quirky motherfucker. You want to get back to my place?" And I was like, "No, but I am honored." <laughs> I I, I went to a, nice I went to a gay bar and I was hit on, and I felt terrible that like. I had to tell the guy I was not going to suck his dick. No, oh. like I felt terrible. Like I really felt yeah, bad. Yeah, I'm like yeah, the yeah. guy bought me a drink. He was like six foot seven. The guy was huge. He would have destroyed my nubile asshole. Mm. Like it would have been terrible. Mm. And I'm just like, I, I he buy me a drink. We're like, I'm just talking to this guy, forgetting. Like this is pure honesty. What did he like, buy? A Cosmo or something? Yeah, he bought me a beer. We were drinking like Miller Lite or something. It wasn't like anything special. But he's sitting there like, I forgot for the moment. I'm at a gay bar. Like I literally forgot for the yeah, moment. Yeah, you were this, it, yeah. Where hey, you're sh- just sitting here chatting, and then like, like, you know, like somebody comes like flittering by. Oh, I'm like, oh shit, I'm at a gay bar. Yeah. This guy's talking. Oh, they to go me. floating by, Al. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but uh, I was just like, shit, I gotta tell this guy. I'm That's not how gonna... he walked in. In 2022, yeah. Al. Yeah. Were the stools upside down? <laughs> oh goodness, guys! I'm just being progressive I'm, here. I'm wondering. No, but they only sold hot dogs, which was weird. Um, <laughs> but no, I, I literally forgot for five minutes, and I'm just like, "Shit, I gotta tell this guy I'm not boy, gonna suck his dick." You look good, boy. <laughs> I literally said I had a great time talking to you. You smell like hot dog water. And boy. I had to, I had to break his heart and tell him I'm straight. <laughs> mm. Sorry, I'm straight for you, boy. <laughs> I'm straight in my pants right now. Oh oh, I'm okay. You look Thanks, like, Laura, oh, for joining us tonight. You look like a little <laughs> silverback. Thank you for having me. No, right. thank you for being you and trying to put Delco on the map. Thanks, and when you, You're going to get our Maxim, and we're going to stick with this. And just like always give us, like, a, I mean, we'll stick with it, but just a reminder. You can us, actually like, call in now and then, like, hey, guys, just want to let you know, still vote for me. We'll put you in the phone line and just be like, make some like, quick videos we'll and share them. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, like it'd be like, yo, you got three days left. Like I've made it this round. Like, all right, let's keep it going. I'm okay. get on it, Delco. Boat. Yeah. Yes, boat. Boat. We are out of here. Yeah. <laughs>